Good morning, everybody. Oops, my bad. Oh, come back over here. Back over here. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come here. Sit down. Sit down. Get paw. Get paw. Oh, good girl. Yeah, he's such a good girl. Down. Oh, is that good? It's a good puppy, eh? You ready for today? Are ya? Got lots of, lots of, lots of snacks for you. Mm-hmm. Lots, lots of lovings. Yeah. Good morning, everybody. How's it going? <clears throat> cheers, cheers, cheers. Happy Saturday. Lulu. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> we just wanted to go to the Sophie camera. Anyway. She's looking so cute. We are in for a nasty storm today, too, apparently. The main, uh, the main part should start maybe this afternoon, late this afternoon. And we are in for intense winds and rain and everything else. We've got warnings. So if we happen to disappear at that time, you know what happened. <laughs> Yeah, it's getting that way. Cheers, everybody. Cup of tea. Cup of tea, cup of tea, cup of tea, tea, tea. You guys are all popping in there. Y'all chipper and you must have had caffeine. <laughs> good morning, good morning, good morning. Oh, Miss Sasslet's here. What time is it, Miss Sasslet? Hold on, let me guess. You're, oh, okay. I have a question for you. Since it's your Sunday, did you spring forward yesterday? Because you could be 16 hours ahead of us right now instead of 15. So I'm going to say it's 3 in the morning. Thank you, Melissa. Thank you very much. It was, um, uh, actually, I bought two. I bought a blue one for Pop and a black one for me, but the black one did not fit me, and there was no way this was going to fit Pop. So <laughs> so I, I was like, oops, didn't like that sizing of that shirt purchase. <laughs> so, yeah, I was like, does it look too much like a pajama top? Because it's not. It's got really long sleeves. I'm going to have to alter it. I wish I knew somebody who sewed. <laughs> and it's a straight sleeve, too. I thought that was a little weird. Here, I'll show you. Just like a straight, you know. Look, nothing up my sleeve. No magics. <laughs> so, yeah, it's, it's not bad. It's, it's, a little, it's a little baggy, but I, I like it, actually. So. And it just rolling up the sleeve. So it didn't look like, you know, I'm walking around and... A tall man shirt. Thank you very much. Cute tunic, exactly. I have a cute vest too, but I didn't want to wear it. Well, thank you very much, Miss Nadine. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Big hugs, big hugs. Happy, happy, happy Saturday. Happy 12 hours. Are you ready? Are you ready? Do you got it in you? I got it in me. You got it in you? Hmm? Do you? Do you? Do you? <laughs> I don't know. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, poof. I'm in, I'm in, magic in the air. <laughs> I'm all about comfort. Yeah, I like it too. It's, uh, it's, you know, I got to pull my pants up though. What I'm not ready for is having to go to work. Oh no, Mike. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> How's Miss Helly? How you doing? How's Denmark today? It's already the afternoon there for you. Hello, hello. Uh, happy everybody came in. Hello. Uh, good morning. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Well, oh, thank you, Kathleen. You're beautiful, too. Big hugs. <laughs> hello, Miss Donna Faye. Hello, Cindy Wall. Hello, Mary. Hello, Josie and Britt. Good afternoon, everyone from the UK. How's the weather there, Britt? 214? Two, yeah, 2014. Two or are you like 2014? Or are you like, whatever, 2114? Or 2014? Hello, Katie Crafts. Good morning from Denver, Colorado. Hello, Kathleen Champ. Hello, Sylvia. Mm. Hubby has hernia and makes my tongue hair tight from my shirt. Well, yeah, you know, I, don't, I just want to be comfortable, you know. Thank you, Miss Diane. Thank you, Marianne. Hello, 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 Donna. Good morning, everyone. Love the top of your. Well, thank you. I I was questioning it because I'm like, does it look like I'm wearing pajamas? Because <laughs> it's not a funny. It's not a. It's not a pajama top. So. But I'm like, should I fold the collar up? Should I fold it down? Do I feel like I'm like, cool? I could do it up there. My little neck. <laughs> Hello, Steph. Welcome, welcome. The cold UK. It's actually not too bad here. It's about 
six or seven degrees, but we are going to get rain in a storm. So thank you. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you, everybody. I'm doing, I'm doing good. Everybody's doing good. Hi. You, you want to come say hi? Hold on. Let me just move stuff out of the way so nothing hurts you. Come on. There we go. Hi. Did you enjoy your little treats? Mm -hmm. Did you? Ooh, big stretch. Oh, big stretch. Oh. I trimmed her claws the other day, yesterday, and she stomped in between Pop's toes, and I guess one was a little sharp and cut the whole inside of his toe. It was, it was like, ouchy. So. Straight quilting with stretchy fleece backing for baby quilt. Never again. Hate it. I like cotton items. <laughs> this is synthetic, and I, and I get static. Oh, yo, yeah, those are not fun, Lisa Lisa. 6.05 a.m. <laughs> well, good morning, good morning. I wish I had, I could, could be wearing pajamas, but, you know, I want to dress up for you people. You know, I'm not hanging out in my jammies. Thank you, thank you. Good morning, good morning. And, and uh, tea, coffee, whatever else. Oh, she's laying on the mat over there. Okay, sorry, no, no Sophie cam for the mat time right now. <laughs> she's weird. <laughs> 1 a.m. and go back an hour in April. Okay, so we skip an hour ahead tomorrow, like tonight, tomorrow. So just so you know, okay, mark your calendars. We spring forward. Thank you. Yeah, I'm, I'm glad I wore it. I'm, I'm getting so many compliments on it. So yeah, <laughs> I love it. All right, so here are our project for today. You have us to sit here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You go ahead and be comfy in your jammies. <laughs> it's a cute little project. It's only going to be 31 and a half by 36. And this came part of a quilty box. Um, welcome to the quilty box. So, and Miss Allison gifted this to me. So, thank you, Miss Allison Johnson. I'm, sure, I'm, I'm not sure if she's out and about camping or if she's home this weekend. I forgot to ask. Um, it requires two charm packs, one as a your background that you're going to use for your your background peoples or your background um uh sections and the other one you're going to chop up and turn them into your beach balls okay and since the kit came with what i need including the backing and i'm sure enough in here for binding it's quite beautiful there okay and you can see that it is from so a Wyndham Fabrics presents Solstice. Okay, very, very pretty there. Actually, the camera's not quite doing it justice, but it's quite lovely. And then there's this here we're going to use for border fabric. Okay, it is very, very pretty. And then this Solstice fabric here, it has as many prints as it does solids, and you're mixing those, those solid colors to these print colors. Oh, sorry. Isn't it cute? Pretty. So yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, you know, cause some trouble. So. <laughs> That's what we're doing today. So it pretty much tells me to take from, and start with the cutting uh, instructions. All seam allowances are quarter inch. From each solid five inch square, cross cut into four squares of two and a half by two and a half. So this could work with a jelly roll quite easily or from your own stash, if it's two and a half by two and a half, right? And then you're gonna cut those squares on the half diagonally to yield you eight triangles. You need 168 total for this. So you'll need 168 of the solid and 168 of the print. And then we're gonna put those together just by sewing in a pinwheel. It tells you which way to push your, push your uh, seams. And then we use the uh, template to cut out. And of course, we're gonna have all these little bits left over. We might be able to sew those little, I don't know, I, we're not gonna throw them away. And it says raw edge applique. So you're just gonna ziggity zag it. Just gonna ziggity zag it. And I'm just gonna use white thread. This whole project, just use white thread. Can we see the pattern? Uh, Isn't it cute? And then you're going to use those cute little fabrics to make the balls. And then we have this for the backing. 
Yeah, the balls would pop better on a light gray for sure. But I think this neutral, the low volume, uh, would, is going to do just fine. And it's going to pop out some of those colors too because some of these uh, uh, low volumes actually have some prints on them. So, But if I didn't want to, um, I could, um, you know, there's another pack here too. What is the name of the pattern? It's sweet. It is called Summer Solstice Beach Balls by Mary Etherington and Connie Tesney. And it's only, it's gonna finish at 31 and a half by 36 and a half. So yeah, we're gonna plug away at that today. And then Munchkin and I are gonna hang out for a few hours after lunch and work on our little project. That should be fun. Hopefully you guys get a chance to stick around for that. It is beautiful, isn't it, Miss Helly? It's gorgeous, gorgeous. I, I don't think I've ever worked with low volume before, so I kind of, I really liked it because it had the, like the newspaper thing, so I thought it was all newspaper, and then I, I flipped through here and I realized it's not, but that's okay. I don't know what's nothing wrong with it. I love it. Give it interesting to the movie. Yeah, because it's got some pattern behind it too, right, Lois? What's the fabric you're using in the gray, please? Oh. It's uh, same Wyndham fabrics, just low volume, multi. Do you want the, the code? I don't know if that's going to help you. <laughs> Before I leave, I would like to remind everyone that Sasselet is a... <laughs> Mike, we used to be friends. <laughs> I was going to say, is, is, is she sponsoring you? <laughs> we'll pop back in later when home. Okay, bye, Sylvia. You take care. Be safe wherever you are. Where you are. I meant light gray thread. Oh, you would use a light gray thread instead of white. Oh, okay, I gotcha. I don't have light gray. I just got white. <laughs> yeah, yeah, should be fun. Should be fun, fun, fun. Yeah, anybody got any questions? Any, anybody got anything to share? Cheers. Just tea. <laughs> Okay, just want to go on up through Chad. Just want to make sure I didn't miss anything. Rough, rough weather this AM. We're, it's headed our way too there, Miss Quilt Tessa. What are you cooking today? I don't know, Pop. What are you cooking today? Um, it did come with one, Miss Lois, but if you look, look, check that out. It's only a tiny bit bigger, not even. It fits inside a paint roll, so you could use the inside of, not the paint roll, I mean the either painter's tape, uh, masking tape, um, those sorts of, the, even, a, even a duct tape. I'm sure everybody's got that around the house, so it fits right in there. Oh, sorry. So I would just use that. Trying to see if my mic's not working or what's going uh -oh. on. Uh-oh. I thought I saw movement over here. Yeah, I can see I can see it raising, but I'm not seeing the actual uh, mm. Yeah, I was trying to figure out his mic. Good morning, you look cheerful. Well, thank you, Susie. I appreciate it. Hey, good looking. What you got cooking? How's about cooking something up with me? Yeah, yeah. Hey, sweet baby. How's about maybe? <laughs> we go on all day like this. <laughs> the fabrics are beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Good morning, Donna. Cold glove. Grub. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome, welcome. Sizzle, she's doing something. Mm-hmm. Welcome, welcome. Good morning, everybody. Happy tea, happy afternoon. Oh, it's Pat from sunny Muskoka, Ontario. At least it's sunny. I heard you guys had some weather. That's no, not your fault. no, no, it's not your fault there, Miss Gwenny. I don't think anybody. Uh, Becky? 
Becky says she can hear you. Unless Becky's hearing thing. <laughs> What's moving outside the window? Uh, leaves, no branches. No, no leaves yet, in hopes of leaves. Just branches. Good morning, crowd time. Shower dress and ready to go, she's ready to rock. All right, you can be my co-pilot today, hop in. Pop is very faint. And Laura says she can hear us just fine. Pop don't mumble. Munchkin mumbles. <laughs> Yeah, so the little template is literally just a circle, okay? There's no, no fancy little uh, markings on it or anything that I saw. And it literally fits right inside this little roll here, so you could just use that as a template. Or even a coffee mug or something like that. Something that you know is going to fit within your, your um, five inch uh, charm pack, okay? <laughs> Okay, so what we need to do is get cutting. So we have our prints, and we have our solids, and what we need to do is cut those in half, and then half again. Okay. The finish size is 31 by 36, 31 and a half by 36. So it's not going to be overly huge. No. Oh. Is that bonus fabric? I hope they didn't count that as one. I'd be very disappointed if they counted that as one. Guess we'll find out when we get there. Mm, Ann Ward, hello, my darling. How are you? I'm packing to move to Nova Scotia near Digby. I am not sorry. I stock away, my dear. Stock away. Okay, Davey, that's a ways away, but we can we 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 can we can we can hook up, girlfriend. I'll be so happy to see you. Wonderful. It's not that far. It's not that far? Not, not really. Well, well, well. That that is awesome. Hello, dear Linda. Good morning from rainy possible snow in Massachusetts. Oh no. Making sweet bread dough in bread machine, then later butternut squash soup. Oh, that sounds delicious. All of it. Yes, please. I'm going to ask for a delivery because I'm a little busy all day. <laughs> yeah. I Happy to, March, and happy to. We are working. It's from the, hold on, I want to get my stuff right here. The Quilty Box. I'm not sure from when. Uh, oh, sorry, I lied, August 2021, okay? It has many things in here, including this pattern called the Summer Solstice Beach Balls. Uh, okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, sorry. Summer Solstice Beach Balls. It takes a couple of charm packs. It's got one that's got a pattern and one that's a low volume. One that's got color, and then this, these are your, you're going to put your beach balls on this low volume fabric, okay? It's going to measure about 31 by 36, and uh, it's, it's lovely. It's lovely. We're using Wyndham Fabrics, uh, Solstice Ruby Bee, which is some beautiful, beautiful colors here. And with those solids here, they're going to make beautiful balls. Ready for the beach, baby. Mm, mm, mm. Yeah, so good morning, that's what we're doing. So what we have to do first is cut these guys in half and then in half. So we're going to have uh, four little squares and then we cut those on the diagonal so we end up with eight triangles, okay? And I'm only going to cut a couple at a time, not a couple, maybe four, four at a time because I, I don't want anything to like shift too crazy like, you know what I mean? So... Thank you. Looks like it does, doesn't it? That's why. Well, it was gifted to me, but then when we reached our 12 hour goal, uh, it was asked what we'd be working on. And I thought it would be really nice to get that little spring feel, summer feel, looking forward to the, the new, new place around us. Cause it'll be a, a new summer for us. We, we've never spent a summer in Nova Scotia before. So, uh, we certainly spent a winter. 
been fun. It's still here. <laughs> it's still here. <laughs> Got snow piles. Uh, there's a couple that are still as tall as me. <laughs> but we see lots of grass. No, like that. that seriously? That's not as tall as me. Right now? It's not as tall as Mm -hmm. <laughs> we we'll go measure the pile later. <laughs> Break time, I'll be out there with the measuring tape. <laughs> All right, so I want to cut these in half and then half. And then do do do. It's autumn here in the real world. <laughs> you think the microphone's a problem? Yes, I am close to the foot of the uh, it seems to be out there right now. So very Hmm. Which is I would love to have Miss Ann Ward as a as a, a, a co-pilot as a co-pilot on a live stream. That would be fantastic if she's up for it. She's good company. I've never even heard of it before, Lynn. So this was new to me. And when Allison said it was like it was part of a quilty box, and it was like there was actually other patterns and other things in here, and you know questions and interviews with the artist and stuff like that. Like it's a whole big thing. Oops, sorry. I just come to show off my new shirt. <laughs> Happy St. Patrick's Sass Day. Sasso's favorite color. Just for you, Sass. <laughs> See, this, you look taller than me. I am. We can't have that. <laughs> Mimi chicken nugget. <laughs> Love you, punk. <clears throat> Nothing but trouble, I tell you. Nothing but trouble. <laughs> All right, so we're cutting in half and then half again. Okay. Make sure it's two and a half. Double check in. Oh, thank you so much. Let's see, is this better? Can anybody hear me now? Seems like it's working better. Hundred year old farm that needs some cosmetic work, but will be great when done. Oh, I can't wait to come and visit you and you can come visit me. Much better, says Becky Wilson. Yes, says um, Sue. And Pat says, yep, yep. Um, uh, what? Okay, so it what? looks like we need to buy a new mic. Awesome. Oh, which is the the cord, yeah, right? Just well, we thought maybe Mr. Clive had chomped that a time or two, or yeah. maybe it's the connector. Sure. Uh, well, your guess is as good as mine. Yeah. True that, homie. True that. Okay, make sure we're doing it two and a half. Thanks, Pamela. I'm glad you can hear me better now. Oh, thank you, Anonymous. I'm sorry, I got yeah. so sidetracked Anonymous. with the microphone and stuff. Thank you, Anonymous. Thank you, thank you. Big hugs to you. Big, big squishy hugs. <clears throat> okay, so are are we okay for the... The stuffs? The pile of stuff? The yeah, the I have not set that up yet. Okay, so. soon you tell me as soon as you do, okay? Yeah, I'll let you know. We're sorry, we're we're way behind. Not way behind. Done. We're just we, we were did twelve hours today. I got lots of time to do. We were work, relaxing right? this morning and not rushing, and that's what I said. I don't want to feel like we're rushed. Let's just go and have fun. The people will understand. Hello, Mr. James. Good morning. Good morning. Don't forget the thumbs up. Says Marianne. Thank you, Marianne. You get two thumbs up. Thank you, thank you. Lord says you can hear us both. Pamela, hear you both. Or hear you better, Pop. There, sorry. Oh, Baze, welcome. How you doing? You got all day, says Gwenny Simpson. <laughs> Been here way before you. <laughs> Battle of the time. <laughs> I made a pinwheel block yesterday. Love it. Well, oh, you, and you can cut it out and then make it into a beach ball, baby. Just put it like that. Aw, thank you, Edward. I appreciate that. 
be lo lovely to see a, a familiar face. <clears throat> indeed, indeed. Looking forward to I, I'm looking forward to seeing what you do with your hundred acres. So you just had to uh, one up me, right? I had ninety. You just had to go get a hundred. <laughs> she ten up. Walks. <laughs> oh, good she boy. ten up to you, not one up. <laughs> True, very true. <laughs> All right. Now it says you want to put them in twenty-one group. Hold on, I did some like divide the triangles into twenty-one groups of eight matching solids. Okay, so we just want to make sure I'm getting my eight in a group, right? Hold on, one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight. Okay, so that's one. Well, this is going to be fiddly fun. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, perfect. And then it's pretty much one, two, three, six. Seven, eight, since you're the same color, and you would make eight. Okay. Well, that's four piles out of 21. Look at us go. Okay. Let's get some more. I got something in my eyeball, besides the eyeball. Mm -hmm. We have 176 people watching this early in the morning. Well, hello, hello. Good morning, good morning. Welcome, welcome. Yeah, we just started. Anybody have any questions? Can I help you? Hello, Miss Bernadette. Good afternoon to the UN Dublin. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Susan. Good morning from, oh, what, what's, what, well, mm, I always had a hard time saying that one. Leslie. Well, Leslie, Ontario. Mm -hmm. for, for me being the queen of mistyping. Oh, yeah, me too. I I'm, I'm made up my own words. Hello, one love. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Vicky Millimimir. Hello, hello. How's Miss Nadine today? Hello, Lisa Jean. Hello, Michelle from Oklahoma. Good morning. No questions. UFOs going on here. Very nice. Kathleen Davis. Very nice. Five-year-old granddaughter here. Oh, yay. Party time at Lisa's house. What are we making? 100 years old. Only, oh, 38 acres all with the river. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Sorry, I misread that. I misread that. Still looking forward to seeing it, though. You're good? Awesome. Thank you, Miss Nadine. The storm has just hit. Oh, yeah. Well, we've got something headed our way, that's for sure. Hello, Susan from Florida. Of course, you have that many. You, the pop, are loved by many. Well, I, I figure it's, it's, it's Sophie, really. <laughs> and she's not even on her bed. She's laying on the... Half on the floor and half on the uh, anti-fatigue mat for the long arm. <laughs> She's weird. Um, well, Can't sit in there. No, it's full. <laughs> Scared myself there. I'm sure my face said that. I was like, what? <laughs> what are you doing? Okay. <laughs> I'll, I'll plop here for a minute. <laughs> you ready? Are we ready? I can push the button anytime now. Okay. Push the button. Pushing the button. See what happens. Did it happen? I saw nothing. Oh, there we go. Ha ha ha! You have your instructions, people. <laughs> exactly. Like Sass is on it. I did get goosed by fabric. <laughs> I did. <laughs> I got goosed. <laughs> Hello, Alta. Welcome. Every, Good everybody's morning. Everybody's joining, but they don't know what they're joining to do. No, they don't know what they're winning. Oh, uh, 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 why is or it? Or are they winning? Uh, oh, okay. It's, it's, it's popping up now. It's just getting... You guys are all crazy now. I see y'all sneaking in there. <laughs> hello, Mimi Howard. I see you. Hello, hello. Hello, Lucy B. Linda Lindsay. Hello, hello. <laughs> Lisa, Lisa, we don't care. <laughs> do, do, do. We don't care. Oh, you don't care what you're winning? You could be uh, winning a pack of non-working Christmas lights. <laughs> so that's what Lisa Lisa gets it. <laughs> if she wins, I'm gonna send her. The, well, I'll send her at least a working pack. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Hello, Samantha Jenkins. Hello, Sarah. Hello, hello. That's all good. 
Hello, Sandra. Hello, Gypsy Moms. Hello, Bonnie. Hello, Marilyn. Hello, Cindy Hall and Donna Riggs. Mm -hmm. Hello, Robin's Nest. Hello, Myron. Uh, my, my Marina. Sorry. There we go. Welcome, welcome. Uh, no exclamation, D. Uh, Caldarola. Exclamation, not an L. That's exclamation enter. Hello, hello, welcome. You guys are going to be about to fast. It will be mom and pop exclusive. <laughs> hello, Valerie. Hello, Judy. Good morning. Exclamation enter. Hello, Sarah Day. Happy to see you. Hello, Nancy and Nina. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Pepsi girl, Miss Viv. Big hugs to you, darling. Big hugs to you. Miss you hanging around. Pepsi girl. Du -du 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 Pepsi girl. Hello, Charlotte. Hello, Jackie. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Glenda. Hello, Mary. Donna. I think it's uh, Denise. Hello, good morning, Mom. Thank you for the job. Well, thank you. Thank you for hanging out with us. Hello, Deb. Hello, Chris. Craft a simple life. Good morning. How's Glenda today? So are you going to tell them or are you just going to No, I'm going to wait till I see more names go past. <laughs> leave, leave them hanging. Leave them hanging. They, they, don't, they, they don't really care, apparently. <laughs> Hello, Caroline. I want, this gives you a chance to say hi to people. Hello, Gidget. 64 whole people so far. 64 whole people so far. 65. Come on, people. Come on. 66. If you're not on live chat where it says at the top, sometimes it says top chat, go to live chat because then you're getting constant what's going on right now. Going into the nail salon for my nails. Taking you with me. Ooh, what color are we getting? What color? Hello, Maxadoodle. The storm is almost here. May lose power. We might this this evening too. So just forewarning, if we happen to lose power this after later this afternoon on our time to the evening, uh, it's the storm that's coming up. We're expecting over over 110 kilometer hour winds. So we may lose power. Hello, Georgina. Then again, we may not. And again, you know, exactly. Great to see you. Exclamation entered entered. Hello, Ocean Girl. Mm -hmm. Thumbs up for mom and pop, says Donna. That would be nice. Thumbs it up. It gives us a better algorithm with people. So even if you don't like it, just thumb it up anyways. <laughs> <laughs> Appreciate it. Big hugs. I think Zone 18, like what's coming up Florida way, coming up on the East Coast, it's got to be doing something. Hello, Kaylin. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Carol. We lost power. Oh, you did, Teresa? Oh, no. Holy cow, Batman. That's a lot of air movement. Yeah, 120, over 110 kilometer hour winds. And then tomorrow is literally supposed to be 80 all day. 80 kilometer hour winds all day. I'm like, all righty then. I'm so glad I got rid of the recycling yesterday. <laughs> oh, you going, you going back to bed? You going to lay on your bed so people can see you? It's not a show without you, you know. And you can't be up here all the time. Yeah, hi. Hi, there we go. Ah, oh, he's a sweet baby girl. Hey, what you doing? Hi. Hello. No, you don't want that. That's hot. That's hot. You don't want that. Hey. Yeah, you good? No? <laughs> Careful. Careful. You don't want that coming down on you. No, oh, hi. Have to go lay down on your bed. Go lay down. Hey, you're a good girl. You're a good girl. She always looks so sad. I feel bad. <laughs> uh, no, he was up before we even came out here this morning. A good hour before we even came out here. So no, yeah, no. He's in the kitchen right now. Uh, he's. I think he's tidying up the kitchen. I can see him from here. Oh, you got the camera on. So do you. Uh, oh, yeah, okay. There we go. Oh, yeah, I can see him. <laughs> hello, Anne. Good evening. Sending love from Australia. Hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. Okay, so um, what you have the potential to win. You do have to be here to claim your prize. No ifs, no ands, no buts about it. You got to be here to claim your prize, okay? 
So we will have them throughout the day, draws. You will get the choice. You, you get to choose. Yes, and I poke them, I think at you. Brand new in the shop. I don't know what color it is, we call it, but it is a beautiful little pink, okay? You can choose a meter of this. I'm talking meter, not a yard. I give you the extra. <laughs> we don't, we, we give extra around here. There's a lovely black, gray on black uh, flower print here. Very pretty, okay? You could have a meter of that. Or you could have this beautiful purple panel, okay? Goes. It's a big, beautiful uh, tree, okay? Okay. Or, because I, I have enough, I have enough if, if, if everybody wants, because people were confused last time that they didn't think I had, I had to take it off the list because I didn't have enough. No, I got, I got enough. I got enough, so it works. There's this beautiful panel. It's like an art piece. It's, it's actually quite large. I'll show you here. Okay. And I will cut some of these up so I could actually show them. So I probably should do that now. But after I... Okay, there's that one there. Or there's one meter of this gold and browny black batik. So a couple panels, a couple meters of fabric. Kind of mixed it up this time. You get your choice. Yes, you did, and it finally arrived. <laughs> yeah, this is really pretty too. I thought it might make a nice uh, bag or even a nice backing to a wall hanging or even added to a wall hanging. Thank you, Gwenny. They're pretty, eh? So yeah, you get the choice. Hello? <laughs> <laughs> you get the choice. Okay, let me cut the ones for the panels out so I can at least show them easier next time. Okay. Thank you, Kathy. Kathy, how's it going? Hello, Sarah J. Yeah, six months ago, she finally just got it. Tina, type exclamation enter into the chat and you'll be entered into the giveaway. Hopefully you guys can hear Pop. I can hear Pop, so I'm okay. assuming they can. Exclamation, enter to enter. Oh, uh, YB, I'm thinking of a caramel latte. Oh, oh, fabric. with that, yeah, actually kind of would look like a bit of a caramel latte. Like a mix in the mug, yeah. It does, doesn't it? Perfect, thank you, Gwenny. Vicky, good. Oh, why does Vicky you say you can't hear pop? And everybody else seems to they can. I'm confused. It doesn't take much. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, here's here's that panel. Okay. He is low here. No, I'm about the same height every time. Okay. Okay, and then let me cut the one of the purple off. Watch it on my TV in sewing room. If I want to chat, have to come into the living room, living room computer. So big hello to everyone. Great giveaway ideas. Going to enjoy the day here with you. Okay, Carol, I will give you an extra minute. If your name gets called, I because you told me you were in another room, I will give you one extra minute to get to that computer, okay? I won't, but she will. I will. Pop won't, though. You're going to have to run. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, don't run. Don't, don't run. hurt yourself. <laughs> You behave. <laughs> Tina, exclamation, enter. I can't enter. Okay. Can't hear very well. How do I enter? Ex, ex, there you go. Uh, exactly like Tina Standard did, and uh, Natalie just did there too. Exclamation, enter. Mm -hmm. There you go, Melissa. Melissa's got it. Welcome, Melissa. 
Pop is better now, says Linda Denton. Yeah, I, I cranked it way up. Hmm. Maybe when the heater shuts off, might be easier to hear you too. I don't know. Mm -hmm. Do you want to change mics? Because, uh, you know, I'm a loud mouth. I can turn my, uh, I don't know. carry a, a weaker mic. Let's see if I can do anything in the... Uh, Pop is mumbling. <laughs> Pop is not mumbling. Hello, Joan. Welcome to the chat. Mm -hmm. Josie Donovan. There you go. There you go. Getting in there. See Hello, Grace. Exclamation enter to win. Your choice. Your choice. I have now capped the system out. I can't make it any louder. And here is the purple panel that you get a chance to win if you wanted them. Right. Birdie one. That's birdie tree. Okay, there we go. So you'll have your choice. You got choice between two panels or three fabrics. And since we have it all out on the table, let's pick a winner. Let's pick a winner? Yep. We're going to have several throughout the day. I haven't decided how many. So, but we're going to pick one winner right here, right now. Winner one has been picked. Mm. K2ESCHLAHT. Are you in the chat? <laughs> Hello, Kay Hilton. Oops, mm -hmm. wrong one. At 2K Eschelat. So they have to say something in the chat to win. They have to say something in the chat to win. Hello, Tracy. Exclamation entered enter. It is it's beautiful, isn't it, Sandra? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You really can't not be here at this point um, maybe they just entered and left i don't know oh there there they are there you, there you go you won now Perfect. what's your choice and don't forget to send an email to pop at info at we .ca and remind me what you picked so i don't it's pick the wrong thing for you so what would you like would you like the panel or a meter of fabric What would you like? What would you like? What You're would not going to do one through five or whatever? No, no, just let them pick. Just let them pick. And then we just, they, they can put it in the email. They want, you know, the black fabric or the panel with the blue swirl. Gotcha, girlfriend. Gotcha. Okay. Done. Done, done, done. And, I, that, and like I said, I'll cut another one for today. So just we'll write this down in case it gets lost. Panel blue. Perfect. <laughs> yes, X, and you don't have to re enter. If you're in there and your name wasn't drawn, you're still in the pool. So don't worry, you still get a chance. Okay? So we got to re re reward all those early birds. Hey, come on now. All right, now I won't get goosed if I sit down in my chair. <laughs> just read in the chat, uh, Tina, Tina Remmel. Just read in the chat. Just like Annie O just did. Good morning, beautiful. Here for the fun. Congratulations, K2. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Angela. Hello, hello. All right, let's get cutting. So now you know what you could win. And you know what's possible to win. That's okay, Annie. What have you missed? Um, chaos. <laughs> no. <laughs> Not too much, just a little bit. <laughs> um, just going um, or, uh, kind of through what we're, we're working on today, pretty much. So it, it is melting, Catherine. It is happily, happily melting. <laughs> and we are expected uh, a rain rainstorm and windstorm uh, later today. So if we happen to disappear, you, you know why. Now, you now know why. Thank you, Sarah. Oh, thank you, Sarah Stevenson. Thank you, thank you, big 
hugs. Big hugs are mean. Mean's pretty big. That's a big hug. I'll take it. Yes, thank you very much for the super chat. I'm not going to go food shopping. It's too cold. Oh. That's why I like ordering and going to pick it up. So I'm taking these charms and I'm cutting them into four squares. And then then for those four squares, you're going to cut them on the diagonal and you're going to end up with eight triangles. Okay. They're wee ones. Once we put these together, we have to square them up to two and one eighth. So that's two and just a smidge widge. So they're going to make small, small balls, small beach balls. Mm -hmm. There you go. Uh, you must have been already in there, Pat. Yeah, so if you don't get you don't get kicked out of the pool. You stay in the pool until the end of the day. So don't forget to send an email, though, K2, okay? Info at wesowit.ca. And make sure you put the blue panel, just in case, okay? I don't want to mess up. It doesn't make me feel good when I've messed up, so... That, that's exactly, so two and a half inch square, not twice, on, quite, not twice on the diagonal, just once. If it's a two and a half inch square, it's just once. Just one, just one, um, one cut on the diagonal. You're going to square them up into squares first, and then, uh, and then you're dealing with tiny triangles. And then those two get sewn together into your pleasing, pleasing balls that you like with your solids and your patterns. And then those get... Um, put on the center of your uh, low volume fabric, your background fabric. Mm -hmm. Hello, Christine. For Lauderdale. So in season for us now, the rain, is that it? Hello, Joyce. Welcome to the chat. Snowing here in Washington, D.C., but not sticking, but very windy. Yeah, we got wind coming our way, too. We got, we got definitely wind coming our way. No, you're in for, you're good. You're good, Tina. If you got in there, you're good for the rest of the day, to the end of the draws. So even though we've had one draw already, you're still in the pool. No worries. You don't have to refresh, but you do have to be here if your name is called. So... You don't see Teen Renamel? R E M E L? Four, six, eight. So, what we're doing is trying to make 21 piles. 21 piles of eight triangles. And you want to keep the, your colors matching your colors you want to keep your solids together and your patterns together because that's what's going to make your unique beach ball okay that's three four one two Tina, just type exclamation, enter into the chat like you just type a comment. Welcome, welcome. How often do you host a twelve? It's whenever we reach our goal of a thousand dollars, a thousand Canadian dollars, um, which helps for repairs and um, uh, for the for the quilt shop. Because we're in a new, we 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 bought property with a building on it that needed work, 
So, and the money that we've raised so far has gone into putting a spray foam and uh, spray foaming and um, heating, as well as paying for the the electricity bill to heat the place before all that stuff happened. Well, good morning, June. Moving into the quilt room so I can do some sewing to, uh, but back in a second. Okay, all right. Hello, Irish Sally lady, Sally lady, Irish Sally lady. Welcome, welcome. Looks like the worst weather has passed us. We made it still under a tornado watch until 11 a.m. Oh boy, Lois, batting down the hatches. Hello, Ray Jean. Welcome, welcome. You could, um, I was just going to say the, 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 yep, do exclamation don't know for that? Yeah, didn't, that's no, it didn't, pop, it didn't pop up. It is up there, I think. Oh, weird. Hmm. There, there is a way. And I, I greatly appreciate that. Thank you. We greatly appreciate that. Oh, okay. There you go. That sounded like a door. Okay, now I'm just trying to make these two and a half by two and a half inch squares. I guess this would be perfect for a, uh, a jelly roll. Okay. Yeah, Tina, you just need to type in to the chat. That's all you need to do. Yeah, it's really simple, Tina. Just type in exclamation enter all together. That's it. Like, there's nothing fancy. There's no other place you need to, to, to type anything else in. Just exclamation enter. Hello, Elizabeth Boyle. How are you doing from Far Fargo? <coughs> Sorry. Fargo. <laughs> I'm loving some of these colors. This one, this one matches a pop shirt today. Do, 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 do. Just like the people before you there, Tina. That's all you have to do is exclamation enter. That that's it. Nothing nothing fancy. Nothing nothing too complicated. Mm -hmm. There we go. Even Miss Ellie's trying to help you there. I like the blue and the green together. Good morning, Joyce. <laughs> Better than cutting it than sewing it. Sewing one. Cutting two than sewing one. Uh, I'm confused by that sauce. I'm sorry. Have a birthday party to go to. Wow. Well, happy birthday to the birthday. There you go, Tina. You got it. You got it. You must have been entered already because it didn't pop up. So you must have been entered already. <laughs> Maybe it went by too fast. Uh, Hello, JK. Welcome, welcome. And the donation from Marianne. Oh, thank you, Marianne. Big hugs to you. Thank you, thank you. You guys are awesome and amazing. Awesome and amazing. Yes, be sure to stick around because Munchkin and I are going to be working on a very fun project. Very fun project. We are both very excited for it. Six, eight, two, four, six, eight. Okay. Do, 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 do. Okay, let's. Get some of the pattern ones cut as well. I don't want to cut all the saws, and then we can start putting our, some of our buddies together. Good morning from Los Angeles, says Christina. Not sure why, but Tina's didn't get put in. Well, oh, but she typed it though. But she even spelled it right. I noticed. I saw. Yeah, I know. So can you put her in? I cannot. <laughs> 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 Tina, try again. That's all I can suggest. <laughs> Don't see your name in the list. All right, I'm going to go get my little thermos over there and refill my tea. <laughs> Just a moment. Yeah, it's all cloudy here. Like I said, we're in for some weathers. 
top of my tea. What am I making? I am making some beach balls, baby beach balls. Gwenny, I did see um, Linda Denton in there, so she's good. There's only... Tina. Yay! Hey, there she is. There you go. Woohoo! You're in there, girl. <laughs> we got you. We got you. <laughs> Just the bot uh, still half asleep, I think. I don't know. He's trying to pick we, people up. We didn't get it caffeinated. <laughs> and tried twice. Oh, did you, Mimi? Oh, sorry. Oh, that's a pain in the bum. Mm, uh, yes. Any, any OC say yep. yes? Yep. Okay. There we go. Woot woot. Yeah. You got it, girl. You got it. You are in. Um, so it's going to be about 31 by 36. It's not overly huge. The finished block size for each one of these beach balls is four and a half by four and a half. And you're going to make uh, some of them. <laughs> a few of them. <laughs> 21, I guess. Uh... No, it's got to be more than that. Oh, whatever. Some. And then when you put your uh, triangles together between your pattern and your solid, you're going to have to square those up or make them to be uh, two and one-eighths. Yep. Including seam allowances. Make eight units using the same medium and dark fabrics. So do you want to just show the pattern up again? Sure can. There we go. That's what we're making today. And it's uh, raw edge applique. So we're just going to use a little template. But if you notice, this is the same size. So you could use that. Okay. That's, we've had some busies. We've had police cars and ambulances and... I don't know what's going on. And it's just killing you. Yeah, I need to know. <laughs> I need to know <laughs> what is going on. Hello, Linda. Welcome, welcome. Anybody have any other questions? Great for it. Wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? It would be perfect, especially for the color. Uh, and it's only like 31 by 36. So it'd be nice a little table topper, wall hanging, little lap quilt, sitting around the fire. Mm. Coming to take you away. Hee hee, ha ha, ho ho, they're coming to take me away. Oh, fire truck too. Oh boy. Oh yeah, yikes. Never good when the fire truck's involved. Yeah, that's like the second time since November that we've heard basically any emergency Second vehicles. or third, yeah. 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 Can you see the road from your window? Not really. It's the trees. There's some trees in the way and have to like weave and dodge through the branches. <laughs> it's hard to be a nosy person out here. <laughs> no, the storm hasn't even hit No. Yet, so I, like the rain was a little unless bit. Unless it's like, further. And the branches are literally not moving. So it's like the calm before the storm. So... I don't know what it is. It's crazy because it was really quite calm this morning. We saw them going out first thing when we came out here. It was about what, maybe quarter after nine our time. So. Okay, we're cutting these charm packs to two and a half by two and a half. And then we're taking those and cutting them on the diagonal. Okay. So Cheryl asks, do we get to see the quilt from Long Arm Wednesday? So Gwenny's quilt. Yes, it's right here. I have it ready to, to show off. It's even bound and ready to hang here in the shop. And I would happily show you as soon as I get these guys cut on the diagonal because me and my whole flaw, I'm going to lose my stuffs. <laughs> I'm pretty sure. <laughs> it turned out really nice and Pop approved of my stitchery. So... I did go back because I realized when I, in the video, I, I went through the top of the trees and I didn't want to go through this. So I picked all that out and then I went, I went around the top of the trees. But I didn't quilt through the truck or the cows or the hay. I let those kind of pop out a little bit. Okay. Let me just sort my stuff. Two, three. Eight. 
Okay, so that's the one pile. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight. It's another pile. Okay, I wasn't sure if those were the same. But they do seem to be ish. So that's okay. Okay, there we go. Here and here. Cheers, everybody. Cup of tea. All right, let me show you. Actually, maybe Pop can come and hold up the other side, so I'm not doing no flippy floppy sort of thing. If you wouldn't mind for a moment there, my dear. Oh, you want to get to the right camera? Yeah, I can, I guess. <laughs> that might be helpful. I thought that's what you were doing. <laughs> Push the button. He's cute. Didn't say it was smart. And then just kind of move that, yeah. And I put a bear in one corner and a fish in the other on the bottom. Uh, and it would switch to the back so you can see. It looks amazing. Thank you so very much, Miss Gwenny, for donating that beautiful, beautiful top. Here, let's show it to the front again, just, just so we could show it off. We, get, we, we don't get to do this often. <laughs> yeah, it's really cute. I mean, it did a good job on the, on the stitching. It's fun. It's got some nice texture to it. I'm nosy. What's in the wicker basket behind you? Oh, my secret bottles of vodka. Shh, don't tell Sassel that. No. <laughs> no, I'm serious. I, no, I'm serious. I'm serious. Look, there's a I'm whole serious. box. I'm serious. There's a whole box of nothing. I got to scoot it up from a wall smidge, though. Fabric! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> What's always in the boxes here? Uh, there's actually one, a uh, table runner, uh, some other fabric in here, a t-shirt, another t-shirt, uh, some, oh, a, 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 a tablecloth that was gifted to me to uh, get quilted up, to do whatever I wanted with. It's got some stains on it though, so I like to I could quilt it up. Nothing, nothing too exciting, though. <laughs> sorry, sorry if you thought it was, you know, something exciting. <laughs> Just fabric. <laughs> Just fabric. My secret stash of booze. And of course, the remember the bumblebee that Munchkin and I made on our on our live stream. I think it was in was it March? I don't, I don't remember. His birthday stream. Was it his birthday stream? Could have been. Because we made one for him and then one for me. That was so much fun. Free pattern. And we used the fabric we had. This is micropolar fleece. Uh, so yeah, maybe not necessarily the black and white bee is the best bee, but it's our bee. And we like them. <laughs> is Kathleen, that if you want to check, just type exclamation enter again. That's the easiest way. The bubble was so cute. It was a good free pattern too. Free pattern, super cute. Not complicated at all, I don't think. I don't think so. Love the braid border, isn't it beautiful? Do you have a video? Of what? The braid border. Uh, not using the triangle or rectangle pieces that uh, Gwenny did, but we do have one using the binding tool as well as the half hexy ruler. Both of them make beautiful braids. I'm curious how LL stitched out the rest of the panel section on my quilt. Sky was sh showing on Wednesday, but not the rest of the panel. Now she's, I, I, do, you, do you want up close or are you good? <laughs> hope it's not a fire. Me, no, I don't hope it's not a fire either. Panda B, yeah, there you go. Oh, Marcus is in the chat. Welcome, Mr. Von Baron. Or Baron Von. Verbally explained would be good up close oh for sure i can i can do it out okay. 
Put it in the overhead, yeah, mm -hmm. I guess. Hold on, I just want to... <laughs> I don't want it to go gravy. <laughs> Move my tea out of the way. Okay. Okay, so here I went from the top. I just kind of went uh, little wiggly wogglies. And then as I came down to other parts of the quilt, I went back and forth. So I sectioned it out two inches by two inches. When it came to the end, because I'm assuming my, my chalk line and as I was moving my ruler, my, my last two inches ended up being a little tiny short. But, you know, it happens. Don't, don't worry about it. Can't sweat about the small stuff. Okay. So let me, the bottom out here, so you can see it. And then as I came down, went across the barn, doing the same motion of back and forth and loop-de-loo, -loo, I went, I completely avoided going around the, or do, going through the truck, the rooster, the hay bale and the cows. I did a, a, a meander, a tight, not too tight, I've done tighter, but a tight meander. And then when it came down to the rocks, I did the back and the forth. Yeah, so the grass grass was slightly different. It, yeah, the it grass was slightly different. I did a meander. I'm not sure if you can really see that on the... It's really hard to see because it actually pops the grass up, gives the grass actual dimension. Yeah. Thank you, Sarah J. Are you okay with that? I, any, I just thought I really gave it a bunch of depth and texture to it. So, but I didn't do the truck. I just wanted the truck to kind of like really stand out like it was it was coming it's coming down the track sort of thing. Oh, thank you, Sarah J. Big hugs. Push the plastic into there. It really does. It does, doesn't it? Really make. I really like it. I showed Pop first. I did some stitching and then I showed Pop. I took a picture, came into the house, and showed Pop. And I said, "Are you you okay with this?" Do you think that'll look all right? And I said, I, I know I was just going to like follow. Oh, thank you, Gwenny. That, that makes me very, very happy. Big, big hugs. Um, makes me very happy. Uh, so, um, and he says, yeah, it looks good. I'm like, okay, because it's a big commitment to kind of go all through that and then go, oh, I don't like it. I got to rip it all out. So thank you. Thank you, Miss Helly. I appreciate that. Thank you, Lois. Appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you, my ladies. Thank you, Nadia. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Melissa. Appreciate it. Okay, El, can you see this? Yes, I can. What, did I miss something? I'm sorry, so Sass. just pop the question up. So, would it work if you had sewn diagonally twice and cut horizontally, vertically, and diagonally twice, making... I think she's talking about the curve. Oh, yeah, project. okay. I, I did think of that. I did as I was cutting, reading it and cutting it. I don't know if you're going to get your two and your one eighths if you do it that way. So, oh, thank you, Nancy. I appreciate that. Thank you, everyone. Thank you. Thank you, Max Doodle. And a stretch of no green to represent size. <laughs> um, I, did, I did think of that because I was like, well, can't this be a little bit easier than just trying to chain piece these through the machine? But I don't know. Uh, you might want to refresh and go on to live chat there, Brenda. To the people in this chat, the braid symbolizes all of you, U.S. flags, Canadian flags, other countries by their color, food for home and hearth cooking, cat, dog for pets, all of it. It's, there's everything in that quilt. It's beautiful. And it really does represent all of us throughout the whole world. And I greatly appreciate it. The, some of the backing fabric is from the So Yeah Brothers. So, you know, we bought it from them. It was popular, they liked it. And I'm like, there we go, let's grab some of that. And he's like, did you use it all on the quilt? I went, no, I just used a strip down the back. <laughs> we got lots, took out like two meters of it. <laughs> No, it's, it's good, it's good, good fun, a beautiful, beautiful project, absolutely beautiful project. Absolutely love it. You think it should work? 
Should we test? Well, you have a spare pack, right? I do have a spare pack. Or do you? No, I do. I do. Are you sure? But I don't... So, hold on. If we're putting them right to the... And then we went... Dun, dun, dun. Dun, dun, dun. Dun, 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 dun. And then we just cut in between. Is that what you're thinking, Sass? You scrap and try, yeah. I was just thinking I have I have I have something around here somewhere, I'm sure. Because right, we're not mixing the triangles, right? So that's not part of the process is mixing up the, the triangles. Try it with scraps, maybe? Yeah, that's what um, uh, Lois just said. I think she just said that. Was it Lois? Yeah, try it with scraps. I think I will. Let me see. Let me see what I got under here. Sasslet said it before Lois, but that's okay. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. Um, there's a question here from Sarah J. Uh, I... Just watched a video you did in August of 2019 uh, in which you did a 3D quilt. It was great. Where are your older videos listed? You might highlight those old videos for us newbies. Uh, Sarah J, just so you understand, we haven't deleted any content from our nope. channel. Nope. So if you go to our actual channel page, you can go to videos and then you can scroll down through the like nine, I think we have 900 Over videos 900, or something yeah. Over between streams and, and everything else. So you should be good to just pick up wherever you want to go and, and look at the whichever video you want from there. Oh, come on, I don't have chat how to find, what? Billy Ball? What's going on? What am I missing? No problem. <laughs> I feel like I'm missing something. Okay, let's just cut five. No one listens to me, evil cackle. Who do you think that's from? <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Dough needed to round loaves. Now I can finish quilting St. Patrick's table topper, then binding. Deciding, <coughs> do I sew whole binding on machine or stitch by hand? Mm, I know that's always. See, when it comes to, I, I was I almost did hand stitching to, for for Gwenny's, but I really wanted it to stand up to people. If they wanted to touch it, hanging in the shop here, you know that sort of thing. So I kind of I just machined it. Question there on the... I'm sorry? Question? From... Oh, Nancy. Nancy. I have a question. When you are... When, hold on. When you are six inches shy on your backing, do you just add the six inches or do you cut and have seam down the middle? Well, that depends. You could add that six inches as an accent color to complement the front of the quilt. I've done it, been there, done there before, done it to customer quilts that were too short on the backing. Um, it just added a big a, a strip and then just continue on with the, the quilting. Um, if you wanted it to be more like a half-half sort of thing, you know, half one color, half another, or shifting it or whatever, or even piece, you can piece a section, maybe colors that are left over from the front um, or, or trunks, and then you can incorporate it into that. So, so it, it, that, it's almost like two quilts in one at that point in time. You're having a quilt for the front and a quilt for the back. So I would just sew on the six inches and go for it. My quilt projects, uh, that, that's not the right pattern for what we're working on today, but uh, it is a good pattern. That's our pattern. Oh, 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 the, uh, oh, it did turn out nice though. It did finish. Yep. 
We awake, in, we awake here? We are. Okay, let's let's try that. Let's hold on. Where's my uh, pencil? I haven't had a pencil here. Yep. Let's do our. Tina, yes, you're still in the drawing. You'll be in there all day unless you win. Yes, exactly. And then you'll be out of the drawing because you won. So was I right on what Sasslet was thinking? I missed it. I'm not sure. Okay, so if we draw these lines, and those are our cut lines, and if we're sewing on a quarter on either side of it, really, technically, here, I just want to make sure. Is this where we're going, Miss Sass? Is that what you want me to try? Mm -mm -mm. Oh, Lisa's got to go. Oh, bye, Lisa. The Hobby Lobby. Oh, can we come too? I want to go to Hobby Lobby. Got stuff I need. Let's go. Let's all go with Lisa. <laughs> Hop in the car. <laughs> On the other tablet, YouTube got my blue tablet lost. Google, YouTube. Okay, Billy Bong. What's going on? So dying on either side, yes, then cut along and then cut. Also, so or also across and down the center. Okay, that's what I've marked here. I have diagonal and then okay. All right, let's let's try this. Let's try your theory, love. Let's give her a go. All right, I got no light. Forgot about that. I was like, why is she not going? One. Uh, you will have to sew around the whole block before you cut it. It's a uh, rough. Hold on. What did they call it here? Do 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 do. do. Uh, raw edge circles. Stitch the raw edge circles to the background. So it's raw edge circle applique. And we'll just ziggity zag it. I'm trying to keep, say, consistent to a quarter inch seam allowance. That's what I was thinking too, Gwenny, but uh, really, and uh, it shouldn't be because we're really doing the same thing, right? But good morning, Tracy. How you doing? Hello, Gazella. Mm, yeah, well, we'll give her a go. Like we said, we, 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 I'm more than willing to try because if it is an easier way to put the blocks together because we just, we're keeping the homies together like the eight and the eight, so like the eight triangles to match and the eight triangles uh, uh, solid and, and pattern to, we'll, we'll, we'll give her a go. Yeah, it would, Tracy Richmond, true. But we're, we're, we're trying. It said you only, need, they needed to be two and one eights in the end for the, for the beach ball. So. You're already in there, Tina. She's persistent. We gotta give her that. <laughs> yeah, we'll see. We'll see if uh, if they are too small. And it's it's a good tester. It's a good tester. We we have the time. We we can do the testing. Uh, just the diagonals. Oh, did I? Mm, okay, hold on. No, then you're only going to get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, you're right. Hold on. Let's be. Oh, seam ripper, seam ripper, you're my best friend. Seam ripper, seam ripper, right to the very end. Okay, so let's rip that one out. Because she'd be wrong. She'd be wrong, wrong, wrong. How do you like it? How do you like it? Not wrong, wrong, wrong. <laughs> That's how I like it. That's how I like it. <laughs> 
with chocolate sauce. <laughs> mm -hmm. Welcome, Chris Hope. <laughs> yes, we've already had a winner today. We've already had a winner, winner, chicken dinner. And you like the blue panel. And we'll have more later. Yes, more. More to come. Do, do, do. Yep. Wonder if Munchkin went back to bed. <laughs> Yeah. Sorry. My least favorite part. That's why I had to make a song, because I thought I was going to go fat poop crazy. <laughs> Hello, Michelle. Welcome, welcome. Where's your rotary table? My what? Your cut rotary cutting table. It's right here behind me. Cecil wants you to use it. Oh. She told you. Bossy pants. Yes. Well, hey, and and he you didn't go back. You cut that line. You are. You cut that line. You are in picking. You cut the what? You cut the line that you're picking out. So rather than sewing it, you cut it. And you don't. Oh, on either side of it. Yes. Yeah. 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 I brain farted. I got all excited. What can I say? Okay. <clears throat> press and it's got to be two and one eighth okay. we get two we get two inches almost bang on. Let's let's try a couple other ones. Let's press those just in case I've done something wrong. Okay. Yeah, we need two and one eighth. I guess you could still do it that way. Like really, what's the tiniest little eighth going to mean to the to the ball? You could even use a bigger circle if you wanted to. So I mean, it's really gonna compound. Hmm? It's going to compound over. Yes, but you're just making a pinwheel and cutting the outside edge. So really you are trimming some of this up. It doesn't actually have to be Sultan. So a scant, yeah, you could do a, 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 a scant one for sure. See, that's coming out more. You got a bit of an eighth on that, but not so there. So you'd have to be extremely accurate with your seam allowance. So... But yes, you guess you could do it that way, but since I've already started. <laughs> Alright. Because I gotta now equal enough cuts for the ones I already have now. <laughs> That's okay, we'll figure it out. But that is definitely is one way to do it if you're not worried too much about the outside uh, making it being a four and a half by four and a half, right? So because you are using the template. To cut right you're just going to cut around it yeah but do you have enough size when you put all those pieces together to get the template on it oh That's gosh what I'm yes saying. oh yeah oh for sure you know once you put all the quarters yeah together. i mean look look at the extra that they have in the pattern itself right so there's plenty that the little outside edge isn't going to be enough right to Well, that's it. That's exactly it, Miss Ellie. And in fact, I think I might go, as Sue Smith just said, on the little bit of a, on the other side. Yeah, yeah, I'm going to. No, no, let's, let's pick a, a, a section here. I like this one. 
I like this color here, and I think I'm going to like it with this little pop of green there. Pop out some of that green in there. Or should we do pink? Ooh, I don't know. Do we like that with pink going into the house? Yeah, sure. Okay, that's fine. Go back to this. We could just go to the sewing machine. We're good. We'll sew those two together. I meant to bring you out a, a glass. I'm sorry. The pink? Yeah, okay, Valerie. I think so, too. Well, I, we're starting off with two and a half by two. Well, okay, I lie there. I'm sorry, Linda Hansen. First, we're starting off with a charm pack, and then we're cutting that into half and then half, okay? And then that, it gets diagonal, diagonal, and then we're ending up with these guys, and you need eight of them, okay? Mm hmm So one together first. Yeah, that's what I was going to do. That's what Sasa said too. Okay, nail, uh, back nails, all pretty in. Oh, very nice. <laughs> Pink. <laughs> no. <laughs> all right. So really, this is going to make two balls because we only need four four sets, four, four, four triangles, four sets of triangles for each uh, pinwheel, right? So let's, maybe a, your um, quarter inch foot would be handy with this. So let me just try and see if I can line myself up. I'm going to try and gonna go on the, just a little shallower side. I know the green pops better and I'll, I'll do another one with green, but the, the, purple, but the pink looks really nice with this too. I got lots of colors to play with, so. <laughs> yeah, and I was thinking that too, Gwenny. <laughs> she didn't get out of bed. And then we'll have to do some, like, serious chain piecing. But let's check this one out first. Uh, yes, definitely, Sylvia. You could totally do the just bam, bam, bam. Definitely. Okay, now let's check this guy out. Yeah, he's almost one and two and a quarter for sure. So I wonder why the difference. Wonder why the difference. You know what I mean? From the one I did as in the dun, dun, dun. obviously it was a seam allowance, definitely. Because I did a, a, a shyer one on that one. Probably would still turn out to be approximately the same. Like I said, you could either do it. You're cutting out the outside edge anyways. You're cutting out around the circle. So, and cutting it in a circle. But, interesting. Hmm, learn something new every day. Mm, what's your stitch length? It's 2.4. Cry out time. 2.4. I usually keep it on uh, the basic for the machine. A little hard to see which was the front and what was the back there. Pink is pretty too. Yes, it is. Hello, Elizabeth. Maybe they wrote to do it that way because you would have always two similar beach balls, so you can so you can mix it better. Maybe, maybe. So you got matching matching beach balls on the on the the quilt top. Been trying to log in since eight forty five. Well, hello, Vicky Robles. Welcome, welcome. It's really 11, well, 11.30 my time. So 10.30, 10.30, wow. Time's going by way too fast, man, I'm telling you. I, these 12 hours do, do go by very, very fast. All right, so let's see about doing some piecing here. Chain piecing. Mm, is Robin from RS Island Crafts here? I thought I saw her earlier in the morning. But she's probably busy. I was curious if she was streaming today. Well, if she was, you guys go make sure you go check her out. We're going to be here hanging out, so, you know. But it doesn't mean you can't, you can't help support another streamer. Here's, this will be the f four of them put together, and then we'll make our little um, doo -doo 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 -doo, um, pinwheel. 
what is the quilt pattern of the quilt behind you? That is the one I did for the collaboration with Sobeka. Uh, last Friday night I did that. So is that the one you're talking about, the pinwheel one? It's a 3D pinwheel. And I will be doing a video on it because people thought it was very uh, lovely and interesting. Trying to make us leave. No, 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 no. Not trying to make you leave. Just trying to help support. Friday night. Okay, thank you, Becky. I appreciate it. I wasn't sure. I thought maybe I, I just kept missing her. I like their little design board that she was doing. I think it's no hot glue. <laughs> I like that. Yes, definitely people burn their fingers on hot glue all the time. Okay, let's jump here and here. And I don't really see the point of squaring them up to one and one eight or two and one eight when we're just trimming the outside anyway. So what do we, as long as the center is bang on, that's really what matters. So, at least I think. Okay. So now to make our little pinwheel here, 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 and here. Okay. What we could do is take off those little tips in the center, even them up. Less bulk and fluff to deal with. Okay, let's set them back up the way they were. Oops. There we go. And then there. So we're going to sew these two together. There. And we'll sew these two together. Yes, exclamation to enter. Thank you, Miss Helly. Don't trim. No, just, no I'm not going to trim them. But just the, 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 the doggy ears. They drive me nuts. Hello, Ann. It's 2 a.m. here, so I have to go to bed and get some sleep. Good night, everyone. Well, we'll see you in the morning. We'll be here at least from eight hours from now. So, <laughs> Kitty looks comfy. That'd be doggy. Doggy, doggy is comfy. <laughs> That's Sophie Lopey. My son's birthday date 13. Oh, wow. 13th. And, oh, okay, I gotcha. Then I found the dress I stared to make when pregnant with. My first, no one needs buttons. I just thought I wanted to see if she would like to. Oh, very cute. Very cute. Sharing the love. Sharing the memories. Okay. It's a little thin. Got to go, Iron Fabric will be watching. Okay, Pat. Be, have fun. I loved uh, Pat Sloan's um, um, quilt project. Well, all the really the beautiful quilt projects he's got going on. Everybody's got some beautiful, fun projects going on. <laughs> yeah, there's you. Soapy. Soapy loopy. She's the star of the show. That's why people come around here, you know. To see my precious little loopy. She's going to be nine come May. I can't believe it. Yes. They're looking now. Okay, duct tape would work well uh, on the design board also. Oh, oh, to help keep the fabric down. I, sometimes duct tape doesn't like fabric. It's really weird. It's really weird. Okay, here we go. It's our first little pinwheel. What do you think of that? Looks all right. Mm -mm. So let's give that a little bit of a press. And that's why I say, don't worry about all these outside edges because you're just going to take this right here, pop it in the center, bibbidi bobbidi boo, you're cutting your circle out, and then you're appliquing it down. So 
want to see if there was a line on here. There is a somewhat of a line. It doesn't seem like it's in the center, though. Kind of how do you mark it with a pencil first and then cut on the pencil? Or I'm not I'm not really too keen on curving. Makes me nervous. Well let's give our go on the whirly whirly, and if we don't like it, we know we have other ways we can go about it. Okay. Oop. Don't do that. Down in the center. Okay. Let's take one of our low volume fabrics. Pop that right in the set. Um, I may know where mine is. I don't think, I don't like that action though, actually. So I think I'm just gonna trace it and. What do you got? What is it? Oh, it's a pizza bun folded over with cheese. <laughs> That's okay. You enjoy. <laughs> Thank you, though. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Now we got one ball. Okay. Bouncy, 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 bouncy. It's hard working with you sometimes, you know. I'm just telling you. <laughs> we back at you. <laughs> There we go, cute, 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 cute. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. Hello, Melanie. Do you have a smaller? I think I do. I do. I do. And I just need to know where I put it. Don't know where I put it. See, you know, I did this thing called tidy up. Yeah. <laughs> I like to stitch the circle into muslin, flip it, flip, and then no raw edges. For, I, this is asking for a raw edge applique, so I'm just following the destructions of the pattern. But I probably would do something similar like that. Yeah, that's exactly it. Yeah, oh, totally, Catherine. <laughs> like that sewing machine panel that disappeared for six months. It was in a safe space. Yep, it sure was. <laughs> all right, tea all done. <clears throat> yep, that's it, too. Turn the, to, to, right down the center in the back and then flip it out and then round out the edges. That language, the language in here is appalling. Tidy up, whatever, whatever next, I know. Clean, organize. But then what do you do with this? Could you, I don't know. And then just sew around the outside edge and the inside edge? Do something else with that? I don't know, kind of make a little funky mug rug. Yeah. So you could put it together and double the size. Yeah, have the inner and the outer sort of thing. Exactly. Kind of cool. It'd be like X's and O's. X's and O's. Where did you end up finding the sewing machine? It was tucked away in the quilt as you go Christmas. So I must have showed it, showed it, because somebody was asking about it. The quilt as you go Christmas uh, blocky thing we did, their little um, lap quilt, and then. 
I was, again, tidying up, and it literally fell out of it. I went to go move the quilt, and it fell, the, the panel fell out. I was like, what are you doing here? <laughs> I'm making beach balls. Make beach balls, baby. Make beach balls. All right, let's, uh, let's change these four. Because I'm going to use the green. One, two, three, four. Okay. Put this together. Mm -hmm. Okay, if we're going to talk clean and I'm out of here. <laughs> She's like tapping out. Nope. <laughs> this is Saturday, people. Don't talk, don't say those swear words to me. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, machine blanket stitch. Oh, that would be nice. That's what, yeah, oh, yeah, I, I, apparently Sass was involved. And I blame a little bit Mr. Clive, too, because, you know, he always had his had little paw and everything. <laughs> Mr. Clive. Eyes closed. <laughs> it won't be long. It'll be quick. It'll be quick and painless. <laughs> it's like ripping the band-aid off. I can't get the band-aid off. Good morning, Miss Deborah Holdman. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Happy Saturday. Happy 12-hour Saturday. Hope you got your go-go pants on. <laughs> Find bit, bit things better in my chaos? I, I can kind of relate to you there, Angela. Except sometimes I got to contain the chaos. It gets too crazy. <laughs> you want to make beach balls? Awesome. And just so you know, you don't necessarily need the template. Okay? These guys are the same size. This, this circular right here and here. And this same size so you don't necessarily need the template you can just grab even a mug you know top of a glass similar and, or whatever just yeah but it's Sunday no it's not <laughs> no it's not <laughs> Sunday we won't be streaming and we skip an hour ahead tomorrow is everybody on that boat too except for sass and um, a few others. Hello, Paula. Hello, happy stitching Saturday. A happy stitching Saturday. Happy stitching Saturday. Come sew with me today. All right, now. Mm, yeah, we all, okay, that's uh, Alberta as well. Jeffers here too. Okay. <laughs> yes, exclamation, enter to enter. And when we come back from our first break, we will have a draw. Okay, a second draw. And um, if you're wondering what's up for grabs, if you're, why you're exclamation, enter to enter, because you want to enter, moderator abuse, what? <laughs> There is three choices. Thank you, Paula. Go ahead. Three, uh, sorry, five choices. I apologize. You have five choices to choose from. And since we're Canadian here, we give you a meter of fabric. There's no chipping you off any bit for the yard there. Nope, nope. You get a full meter here. This beautiful panel is up for grabs if you wanted that. You get your choice. You get your choice. So I have two panels and three bits of fabric. Okay. So there's that one there. Oops, this one here, I'll show you sideways first and then I'll show you this so you can see it. There we go. Beautiful, made a couple beautiful quilts out of this. This one, one, one for a baby girl and the other one was a uh, giveaway for the family reunion and it was absolutely loved and adored. So there's those two. Okay, I don't wanna lose me bits there. Okay, okay, okay. 
And then I have, you get your choice of one meter of this black with gray. It's got beautiful flowers on it. Very, very pretty. Okay, you get a meter of that or a meter of this pinky kind of coral. I'm trying to figure out which color is actually more like it. It's actually darker on the main camera. It's actually darker than it is, but it's also lighter than the desk camera. So it's somewhere in between. It's somewhere in between. It almost kind of looks like this one here. See a little bit of color difference there? So, okay. So there's a meter of that, or I've got this really cool batik. It's got a lovely pattern on it. It's like a chocolate brown, black brown, and then like a caramel color. So make sure you exclamation to enter to enter. All right, so you get a chance and you get to pick. You get to be, I want you to be happy. So, you know, you get to pick. And you must be in the chat to win and you must be, uh, must send an email uh, to info at we sew it .ca so that you can win. Hopefully you guys are all heard pop there. I hope so. Oh, there we go. There we go, Miss Nadine. Perfect. And I have that other truck one, that uh, Christmas one that you sent uh, to the quilt shop too, Miss Nadine. <coughs> That's still on the to-do list. Just taking the dog ears off on the one corner section that, oops, I should probably see, make sure I'm doing it on the right corner section I need. Yep, yep. Paula, if you win, it's info at we sew it dot ca. Okay, I'll take those. Put those together. Um, info, I N F O at we sew it, W E S E W I T dot C A. We sew it. Um, okay, wonderful, Melissa. That's good. Uh, they, they were actually a two and a quarter, Miss Sass. They were two and a quarter. Do you see the pics I sent on Facebook? Yes, I did, Tracy. I did. I did. Beautiful work. Beautiful work. Thank you, Miss Helly. Big hugs. How's Mr. Bastion today? Such a cute little... Such a cute little bug. I can't wait to meet him one day. Because I will. I will meet him one day. Hello, Miss Hilly. Welcome, welcome. Hello, Sinbear. It's been a while since you've been here. Welcome, welcome. Uh, my daughter's going to take Ferris for a hike this morning with our friend and her, sec two, uh, her, her second her, her, her second black labs. I'm like, what? Her two black labs. I gotcha. That's, that's an armful of pup-ups. <laughs> uh, I'll have to look, Hilly. I don't remember if I saw it or not. I'm sorry. He will come over tomorrow. I haven't seen him in two. Well, I was wondering because he haven't posted any pictures. They got sick. La oh, so they were sick last time. They didn't get sick from you, I'm assuming, right? So, how much bigger is a meter than a yard? Um, four inches. Well, I go forty. I always cut it at forty because I don't know for the like trying to go on the previous cut and then this cut, what if you ended up being short a little bit? I don't want to ever short my customers. In fact, for a while there, I was cutting them at anywhere in between 40 and 42. Just give a little extra generous, just, just to make sure. I said, if anything, you at least get one strip of a uh, two and a half inch strip to go to into the, your scrap bucket. So I usually cut at 40, or a little bit over 40, so. Hey, four inches is four inches, man. Let me tell you. <laughs> Does it cost you just as much to ship to us as it 
is for us to ship to you. Uh, uh, yes. <laughs> yes. Approximately. Approximately, yes. Uh, oh, oh, not, oh, yeah, no, sorry, 37, 39.37. Well, it's close, close enough. Like I say, I always give a generous cut. Because I have purchased fabric from... Size matters. You bet that, right, girlfriend? Um, I have purchased ma fabric from uh, shops here in Canada and in when we lived in the States as well. I bought fabric there. And oh, you get it home and you measure it out and you're gypped because they cut it on an angle or it wasn't it wasn't a, a flat edge to begin with on them when they started. So, or, you know, they, they took it from the longest part counted there but there was like still this angle of fabric that was missing oh, I, I get real mad so I'm always watching them like a hawk when I when I, I do buy fabric so if, if I'm there in the store and sometimes shipping doesn't always happen when you want it to uh, packages go missing for months on end <laughs> I'm trying to think of how long it took the one for Miss Ali to get. It was like four and a half months, but the record goes to Miss Asselet. Three, six, and, six and a half months, almost seven months to get a package to her. So. Again, that was during COVID and. Yeah, yeah, definitely. And no packages were flowing through mm -mm. Uh, Australian customs. No. So now I've, I've, I've stitched it. Here's our little pinwheel and we're going to make a ball out of it. We're going to make a beach ball out of it. I'm not comfortable with going around the curve with my rotary cutter, even if it was a smaller one. I'm just for my own comfort and convenience. So I'm just going to take my little pencil and mark around this guy and then cut it out. Thank you, Cindy Hall, for the donation oh, of $25. Thank you so 36. much. Big hugs to you. Okay, and then I'm, I'm much more comfortable by doing that pencil mark and then just coming in with a very nice pair of sharp scissors donated to us from the Soya Brothers. So thank you very much, the Soya Brothers. I've thanked them many, many times, but I don't think you could ever thank somebody enough when they give you something so beautiful. So I've never had such beautiful scissors before. There we go. And then we'll just take our little background fabric. We'll just take that one. Pin her down. Thank you, Paula. Can someone tell me, is this a new shop? It is. We are in a new, we're in a whole new province. Thank you, Paula. Big hugs to you. Thank you, thank you. All right, so now we got two balls. We bounce, baby. <laughs> they are totally cute. And like I said, you don't need the template. You can use this for something else. Uh, or just scrap in it, find find a home from, I don't know. Make some colorful things that fly in the wind. I don't know. No, it's not. It's not. Uh, this is uh, the project was gifted to the quilt shop by Miss Allison Johnson, and it is part of a quilty box um, uh, kit of things to do and interviews and with the people who make the stuffs. And it's uh, you know it's right there. Super cute. Summer solstice beach balls, approximately 31 by 36. And if you don't have the template, this fits absolutely perfectly. Same size. So you can use uh, masking tape, duct tape. Everybody's got duct tape. Don't, don't lie to me. You've got duct tape. What you do with it is your own business. But you could always use the inside of that as your template or mug or a cup or if you want to take more advantage of the five inch square you could go the outside edge of a mug a thing like you know yeah so thank you chris thank you chris we had we it was a it was an adventure um it was a not i'd say it was tough decision but not a tough decision all at the same time too like we needed to change the quilt shop was getting way too much for the house. We were tripping over things. There wasn't enough space for anybody to really stand and chat inside the quilt shop. 
between batting and quilts and projects and fabric and things needed and camera equipment and everything lights and doodads and thingamabobs and whatchamacallits, all of them, like all the things. It was getting too much for that little space. So, and we knew we couldn't do anything with the property that we had without it literally costing this arm and possibly that leg, okay? because of the cost it was to build in Ontario. So the property taxes, the size of the buildings and everything else like that. Plus, you know, uh, we couldn't have put in a, a sewer septic system here. We can, if we want to like this building, we can put a bathroom into it. We can build off the side. We can, we, we got things we can do. The building needed some loving. It was just a wood workshop with just basic, I don't know, two by six boards, screwed into the floor on what are we at joe's no um uh, no the, what's the the pillars the pillars in the ground they're just pillars okay whatever anyways um and and it needs some loving it's like i said it's a wood shop it's the roofs the ceiling needs to be done the roof needs to be done we've got spray foamed underneath we could have been in a, a, a propane heating system um it heats it very nicely it's a little loud sometimes but it's just you know, when it comes to the nicer months, it's going to be absolutely gorgeous to have the windows open and stuff. So, yeah, no, we're, we're happy. No, Tracy, it's actually on uh, cement pillars. Cement pillars. Yeah, not railway ties. Uh, they're like supports. The, I don't know, the, the thingamabobs. <laughs> <laughs> so Marie had a question there. Uh, the leftovers, when you cut the circles, can you not incorporate for the border? Maybe they're very tiny, though. They're tiny. Uh, I've risen from the abyss. It's been so long. <laughs> I'm glad you're here, Marie. <laughs> um, on iPad versus iPad. There we go. We're a little bit bigger on the, on the iPad. <laughs> I received the Amazon package due on the 22nd already. I'm in Australia. Oh, so you, you got it early. Very early. 10 days early? Or... It was due on the 22nd of last month, and you're just getting it now. Piers and Joyce. Yes, that probably Patty C. So, yeah, I don't know. It's little. It's little bits. You probably could sew them together and, and you know, and make some, make something. But it does, it does, did include some border fabric. So, some beautiful border fabric here. I <laughs> mutilated them. <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> Could you do a, re a reverse beach ball? Basically what we were talking about earlier. Oh, with the foundation and split and, and then, then, yes, totally. Yeah. Uh, exclamation, enter. Miss Pamela Baker. Is there a word for any, any giveaways? Yes, there is. Definitely. Gotta listen to mobile. I have to go deal with the horse. Uh oh, cross your fingers that he's so, he is sold today. Okay, fingers crossed. I got my two packages two weeks. Okay, that's what I was trying to get to. At there you go. Hello, Denise. Hello, hello. Mm -hmm. And how's Miss Pam today? Hello, Louise. Welcome, welcome. It's got a little chilly in here. Why did that stop? I don't want to have to put my sweater on. All right, let's cut some more. I'm just gonna take some of these colors too. So you start off with the charm and you're gonna cut it half and a half and then those ones on the diagonal. Welcome, welcome from Southern Oregon. Mm -hmm. Doing, okay, sorry I missed you the other, oh, I was waiting for you to call. <laughs> I was like, and then it literally got to like late in the afternoon. I'm like, oh, maybe she got busy. She got, she got sidetracked by something. So no worries. We can catch up next week when, cause you're on spring break. Right. So thank you, Melissa. Oh, big hugs. Thank you. Big hugs, Melissa. Thank you very much. Yeah, we got Munchkin and I have a really fun project we're going to work on after lunch. What time is it now? Oh, I want to make sure we're keeping up with our break times. Don't want to, don't want to not. 
almost ready for break number one. So make sure you type exclamation enter to enter because we were going to do a draw for some goodies after we get back. So don't go away. You have to be here in the chat to claim your prize. We say your name, you don't say anything, you don't get no prize. <laughs> so it's pretty much that simple. <laughs> Oh, Carolyn, welcome, welcome. If you see two different names with the same emoji, it's because I have two phones on. Oh, oh boy, wow, I can barely handle one phone. Are you kidding? <laughs> you are skilled. <laughs> You testing things? <laughs> I'm not sure what's going on. Uh, it shouldn't be switching. It's switching. I don't know what's going on. We've got the Be Right Back screen now. We're still here. Don't go away. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> welcome, Connie Sue. Welcome, Jennifer. Welcome, welcome. We're still here. We're not on break yet. There we go. <laughs> like, you see if you're paying attention. <laughs> <laughs> L L and Hilly owe oh, you guys an explanation of why I was MIA. We'll be sending it to you in the next week. Oh. You can't chip babies. <laughs> I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> now I'm curious. <laughs> well, I'm happy you're here, Marie. I'm happy you're here. Hopefully everything's A-OK. -okay. Good morning all, just got up and logged in. Well, welcome and good morning. We are just about to putter for our first break. I think I'm gonna put them in the piles of four because I'm not getting too confused by the piles of eight for some particular reason. It doesn't take much for me to get confused. All the shiny objects in the world. Ooh, what? Ooh, that'll be nice with that. That'll be purdy. And then this one. I could do that one. That'd be purdy too. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Did I do that one? Of course I did. Mm. Sass did it? Of course she did. <laughs> Even Pop was confused. <laughs> Sass attack. That's funny, Craft is a boy. I like that. <laughs> I'm not sure if Marie had that question there. Oh, oh. Or whether that was for you or somebody else. I was the one asking you for the measurements for the spools to border my sewing machine pattern. Thank you, Sherry, for the uh, oh, wow. super chat. Thank you. That's Thank a huge you. super chat. Whoa. Wow. Oh my gosh. Thank you so much. Holy moly. Wowie wowie. Thank you, Monte Pep. Sherry from New Jersey. Always love your live streams. Well, thank you very much. That is a big, big squishy hug to you. Hello, April Green, Joellen, Claudette. Hello, Miss Diana. Hello, Lena. Lana. Lena. Lena. Lana. Lana. Dana, Lena. Mm. Hey, we can get that mic now. I was the one asking you for the measurements of the spools to border my spools. Is that a project we did? Is that like the, the sewing spools? The, the thread spools? I'm curious. Well, oh, thank you, Miss Quinny. I appreciate that. Whoops, fell out of my chair. Oh, no, are you okay, Miss Ellie? Are you okay? <clears throat> yeah, we did a spool quilt. Yeah, I know, but I was trying to I was trying to think of what were the measurements for the side. And I, if I missed it, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. Yeah, I want to know if she was okay, too. <laughs> she fell out of her chair. <laughs> Jim made me go and eat breakfast, so I was off PC for a whooping 15 minutes. There, well, at least you ate breakfast, Vicky. At least you ate breakfast. There you go. Baby steps. 
Yeah, so don't forget to, um, to type excl exclamation enter to enter the, um, the giveaway. That moment when your brain stops working and needs it to be kicked. <laughs> Jump start! <laughs> It was the donation, the two hundred dollar donation that made her fell off the chair. We really appreciate that. Thank yeah, you that's very much. amazing. Thank you guys so much. You guys, you're you're earning you're earning the next stream. <laughs> well, the the super chats unfortunately don't earn money towards the next stream. It's only the donations, right? Uh, I I did not know there. I'm not sure what just happened. Yeah, you made me too, Lois. <laughs> Words are hard some days. <laughs> Words are hard, like, most days. <laughs> it's become harder for me lately. Not sure why. Not even sure why my shirt looks blue when it's green. Where are you? In the you. bottom. Oh, the program thing's on your yeah. face. I can't see you. Your face. Your face is covered. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, exclamation enter to enter. We're going to go for a quick break. I'm just going to make sure uh, the puppers gets out and I need to refresh her water. I forgot to uh, dump the old and put the new stuff in. And um, and that's it. And then we're, we're, we'll, be, we'll be back and then we'll have a giveaway. Okay, so just a quick break. We like to try and keep it about every two hours-ish. You know, sometimes we get a little wayward in the afternoon when we're having so much fun. But um, thank you, guys. <laughs> thank you very much for all your love and support. Oh, hair appointment. There you go, girl. I had mine done last week. I, had my, I, feel, I feel so much better after a haircut. That's for sure. Especially when it gets all crazy and my antenna keeps sticking up at the back here, trying to tune into my home world. But... <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Deborah. Good to see you now that you found me. <laughs> Tag, he's it. And now we'll go to break. <laughs> yeah, we just, we'll go for a little break. And we'll see you in about, about 10 minutes, okay? So, so get a stretch, uh, get something to eat, um, potty, do a little laundry, whatever you got to go. Uh, see if you could give me measurements to make smaller spools so I could border the sewing. Oh, okay, okay. I think I, I remember that. I remember that now. Yes, yes. And I, I'm, I, I meant to do that on them at least. All right. I don't know. I didn't know. Um, I, I guess I was brain farting. So, why don't you call on your name? <laughs> Wish you knew I was there. <laughs> Isn't that the truth? All right, Sass, we're watching you. All right, back in, back in ten, okay? Thank you, Donna Faye.
Oh, here we go. Yeah, yeah, no, it's just a quick break. <clears throat> Had to go potty, refresh my tea. Some bit me. Mm. Hummingbird project. That's the um, stained glass um, applique, Miss Sylvia. I was, I wanted, I want to do it, but I don't know if she'd allow me to stream it because she's doing it herself. You know what I mean? Or like, but I would love to do her project. You're a moderator in her channel. See something good about us. <laughs> Peace. <laughs> Don't lie. <laughs> I think it's beautiful. And I like the size of it too. That's a good size. Mm. Did I? I don't know. Someone says the audio is lost. Oh, okay. I was like, did I maybe forget to turn on something? No. Nope, yeah, well, <clears throat> do that. Janine, seems like there might be an issue. Mm, sound design, okay, all right. Okay, well, when, when somebody says like, they can't, that's when I was like, ooh, what's going on here? But I was, obviously, I think Sylvia could heard me, so I was like, wait a second there. Am I talking to the voices in my head again? Hello. <laughs> yeah, she's doing a beautiful job. And I like it that you could paint it, color it, fabric it, whatever you want. You can like yarn spools it, bead it, whatever. Like I like the whole, did you get your peacocks? In? No, that's a work in progress, Miss Kathy Kathy. <laughs> it's a work in progress. I, ha I have the bucket I and I did get all the fabric cut, right? except for the colored parts. I got the whites and the blacks all cut and ready to go. So it is going to motivate me to do it. That's on the UFO to-do list. And I, I was trying to get at least a couple blocks done each month and I, didn't, I don't think I got anything done for February. So I need to catch up in March. Mm. Audio's fine. Okay, thank you. Hear you okay? Perfect, thank you. No, she's doing a fabulous job. And I, I, I appreciate her as an artist. She's very talented. I like how she explains things. Um, she doesn't talk down to you. She talks to you like an equal when she's trying to explain something. So yeah, I, I appreciate her channel very much. So, so check her check her out. She's very she's very popular. Good morning from Texas, this is Ms. Topaz. That, that's my uh, November uh, stone. Same with pops. So we we're we're partial to topazes. So welcome, welcome, welcome. And the pattern is free. I think it as long as you. Give her credit. Oh, which I totally would, Tracy. You, if you've ever been around our channel, we're always, always giving the the goodies where they need to go for sure. We don't. We're not. We're we're not hoggies. Uh, angels ornament patter, super easy to do and cute. Oh, I'll have to check that one out. Ms. Lana, welcome, welcome. Make sure you guys are on live chat when at the top of the chat. It says either top chat, and if you pop it down, like there's a little arrow right beside the word chat, go to the live chat. So then you're in the here, in the now, you're up to date on what's going on. For sometimes if the top chat doesn't, it misses things and you end up being far behind and it's a little weird. Just reached out to her and she's building a good relationship or a future too. Mm -hmm. Oh, just reach out to her. Okay, okay. And it's, oh, I, I gotcha. Good, good points there, Gwenny. I appreciate that. <clears throat> I got a bag of someone else's UFOs. I haven't looked at them yet. Maybe later today. I have a beautiful uh, someone's UFO. I would love to share you, but share with you. Okay, last call before we draw the the draw for the goodies. Exclamation enter. Do it now, and I will show. I'll grab what I have as someone else's UFO, and how I think I'm going to finish it off. Okay. Exclamation, enter to enter. Don't miss out, people. Come on. <coughs> Sorry, excuse me. Mm -hmm. All right, move my tea out of the way. Now, I literally couldn't believe I scored on this. 
I was like, are you kidding me? Are you sure you don't want anything for this? In fact, I offered on two occasions to finish it, quilt it, like qu quilt it up, batting, backing, binding, everything, and give it back as a gift. And she didn't want it. I'm like, okay. So obviously it wasn't, it wasn't wanted, wasn't had fun, wasn't good memories. It's okay. It's good memories for me because I love it. Okay. Now I've had this so long that it inspired the purple, scrappy purple Lone Star quilt. And that was done for Pops Auntie Julie four or five years ago. What do you think it was? And the, I think the main reason they weren't happy is because the center. And I left it. I left it the way it was because I wanted to see, for one, if I could make it a little better. And two, if not, a big old button or a big old, you know, yo-yo on top of that. Nobody's going to give two twiddles. You know what I mean? So isn't it gorgeous? I know, I know. And I, like I said, I offered to finish and give it, quilt it, give it back. Like no problem at all, just for the fun of it. And just for, for the fact I, I was working on something so beautiful. It reminds me of a Judy Niemeyer quilt, you know, and those are absolutely stunning. So, but I, yeah, and so, and I do have bits. I have, I even have the bag of bits that came with it. If I wanted to do what I could to make it fit better or look better or whatever. So either way, there is a plan. You know, just even if we just, uh, you know, it's it's fine. We can figure something out to pop. I think a hexi right in the center would work. A hexagon? Yeah. Oh, that would be pretty because I could we could cut it out one of these fabrics and take all the colors and make a hexagon out of it and then. Oh, like a little collage of mm -hmm. um, from everything in there. That's a good idea, Pop. That's a good idea. Just enough to to cover just a little bit though, because we want the hexi to like really. Sp like yeah, spot off it's, it's going to be like small. Right, small, tiny one. Yeah, But a absolutely. patchwork kind of one out of the material. Very good idea. <clears throat> Mariner Star. Oh, I like Mariner Star. I don't think we've done one of those yet. I would love to, though. That's definitely paper piecing. Paper piece, a hexagon set. Yeah, that's what that's what Papa was just saying there, Craft a Simple Life. I'm not sure if you could hear him. Paper piece, the center. Yeah, yeah, the, you guys are having a great idea. So a dream catcher in the center? What's a dream catcher in regards to that, Pamela? Pam, sorry. I, I score, like literally, I'm not kidding. I feel like I have scored. Like, my precious is now back off, people. Watching you. Mine. <laughs> and I think it'll be so much fun to finish it up. I know, right? I even was like, are you sure you want to give this to me? I must have asked her. She, she's probably flipping annoyed with me how many times I asked her. She was absolutely sure on this. So, uh, heat and bond the back, then add something on the top. Yeah, that make kind of, the heat and bond would definitely have those angles lining up better than trying to actually put in a quarter inch seam allowance or shy of, you know what I mean? So, all right, let's do a draw, baby. Mm, mm, mm. No, that's not a giveaway, Anio. <laughs> nice try. <laughs> it's stunner. I love it. And I love it. And I've been trying to think of ways how I'd want to quilt it, how I want to finish it. I've actually tried to find um, just a little bit. I think I may just have to use plain black, but something to border it up just a little bit. Just a little bit. <coughs> I need to remind the bot it promised to draw my name. <laughs> so Catherine Canales. Catherine Can Canales or Canales? 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 Please say something in chat. So we apologize for butchering yeah, yeah, your name. Yeah, we definitely apologize for butchering your <laughs> name. <laughs> your task not working. What's going on? Refresh there, Nancy. Yes. Refresh. I it is a beautiful top, isn't it, Lori? I'm, I, I literally feel so honored and treasured to have it. And I'm looking very much forward to finishing it up. So it is part of my UFO project. So 
And it's big too. I forgot how big it was until I was showing you. I'm like, wait a second. I thought it was like maybe like a little a little smaller, but it's big. It's a big pro. And I, I asked her. I asked her many times because I would have been so happy just to clip that up, finish it off, clip it up, give it back to her. You know, like it's been so much fun to work with all those little spots and do something custom quilting and it just be so. It, and the exactly, Lana, exactly all that work already put into it. So, I think the bot ignores me. You're not bribing it enough there, Sylvia. <laughs> <laughs> the bot is completely impartial. All right. Has Catherine responded? No. Have I? No? Okay. She has not. So, Catherine. She has another approximately minute. You have about 50 seconds to get to the computer to type in something. Happy face, exclamation mark. I don't care. Just do something or we have to draw again. You have to be here to win, win, win. You have to be here to win. One of the streamers I I, I love and, and watch and adore, he does a every second Friday on his streams in the morning. He's making something. Well, he's usually made it beforehand, but he gives it away. I literally almost cried I because I missed yesterday's in my enter to, in, <laughs> enter in to win one of his little sculptures. So... I was like, Ugh. Thank you, Kathleen Davis. Oh, thank you, Kathleen Davis. Cheers. Thank you. Thank you, ladies. Thank you, Donna Faye. I scooted out for my break and Pop was Donna Faye. And I'm like, thank you so much, darling. Thank you, thank you. Your your quilt is almost done on the long arm. And Kelly B. And Kelly B, thank you so much. So what pattern is that quilt with the star? I wish I knew, Diolanda, Diolinda. Um if anybody knows, please put in the chat. Um, I, I didn't get any instructions uh, with it. I just got the top and some and that little bag of, of scrap. So I, I, I wish I knew. It, okay, it, so I've given it an extra time. So. Okay, she's not here. So we're going to redraw for the goodies. Drum roll. Button pushed. Angel N is so nerdy. I love that name. Deborah Holman. <laughs> She's got lucky stars. Are you in the chat? She was earlier. I'm not sure if she is now, though. Yes, exclamation enter to enter. There she is. Ooh, she quick on the draw, girl. You get, you get a bonus. <laughs> and I'm not kidding. <laughs> Only well, if she sends an email. Well, she will. She said, you still, I know I know where you live. Not like I'm a stalker or anything, because, you know, we haven't had the cops involved. But just saying, please send your email and your address to Pop and then what you pick, okay? <laughs> And what would you like? Did you see did you see your choices or would you like your choices to be shown again? <clears throat> what, what what would you like? <laughs> Cheers, Ellie. <laughs> what would you like? Do you want me to show you? I have to get dressed and work a bit. See you in about 40 minutes. All right, girlfriend, we'll be here. We'll be here. Hello, cat girl. Welcome. Hello, Lois Dawn Stanley. Welcome, welcome. I was so excited when the name Deborah was first mentioned. <laughs> Aw, sorry, Deborah Davidson. <laughs> the bat? Uh, the, uh, the bat? What bat? What's the bat? Oh, the batik. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, was there Halloween was, fabric in I was that like, mix? What did I pull out? <laughs> to rethink that thought. <laughs> 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 so this lovely baby right here, I got you. I will cut you off a generous meter, okay? <laughs> but we won't do that right now. Make sure you add in your email to Pop that you wanted uh, one meter of the batik, okay? <laughs> so like the, we're all confused by the bat. For some reason, Batik didn't come to mind when it was the bat. For some, you know, <laughs> I was thinking panel or color fabric. So, <laughs> thanks for the giggle. I appreciate that. 
Uh, oh, hello, Gazella. Sorry if I missed your message earlier. I apologize. I am making a little beach balls. We're bouncing, baby. We're going to bounce around. So what we're doing is we're making small pinwheels that end up being about four and a half by four and a half in the end. And then we're taking a template. But if you use the inside of one of these guys, whether it be duct tape, masking tape, painter's tape, whatever, it is pretty much the same size. Or you can find like a mug or a cup or something else like that that fits the within a five inch square because that's what you're working on. You're working with charms, okay? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Give bat the options. <laughs> It was funny. I want a bat. <laughs> yeah, I was like, we have plain fabric. I don't know if we got bat fabric though. You know. Well, I was I was wondering whether she wanted us to send her batting. Oh, we could send her batting. I mean, you know. So. <laughs> All right. Well, perfect, Deborah. I'm glad. Congratulations. Congratulations. I'm glad you liked that. That was that was like, woo. That was a like a steel deal find for me. I, I I was very happy with that one. So I think it would make a nice bag. I think it would make a nice bag. Either either inside to a bag or parts of an outside bet you know what i mean so I, i'm excited to see what you guys do with your stuff so yeah we're making these uh the project is going to be about 31 by 36 sorry got dirt in my eye or something and uh it's a it's a cute really easy pa uh project and we're uh, rough edging or um raw edging appliqueing down into the center of the charm squ charm square yeah yes it is a, a charm square too it comes, the pack was one of these and hold on. I ended up getting two. So it was a package of the solstice. I'm sorry. There we go. Realize we're pop had you here. Package of the solstice, which comes with the kit because this is a quilty box. So it came with my solids and my patterns. So I'm cutting these guys on this way and this way and then on the diagonal both times. Okay. So that's giving you what you need. And then you're placing your balls on this, which is low volume. And it's, oh, butterfly. Butterfly, look at that, look at that butterfly. Awesome. Pat never got her package. Oh, I still have it at the house here. I'm sorry, Pat. I'll let you know when I mail it. I was really wanted to get it done like last week or the week before, and I'm so sorry. It's still here, because I got your bag with it too, and then I wanted to send you something else, and then I, sidetracked I'm sorry it's still here it's still here same with Miss Helly's and her uh, baby announcement for for Mr. Bastion it's still here I'll let you know I'll know when it's when it's on the way so you can keep an eye out for it oh totally totally <laughs> Tracy understands <laughs> so yeah and aren't they cute we got cute little balls play with hello Judy welcome welcome oh Helly's going okay I just saw some of the beach balls we're not cut from the center so you don't need to cut. oh you mean on here is that is that what you mean I'm, I'm... or you mean mine did I do bad hold on be the judge people they all look to be cut from the center on the pattern they do or they don't? They do. Uh, there's a couple of them that are a little wonked. I could see them. Yeah. Well, we're not out for perfection, right? So we're just out for having fun. No, I'll let you know, Pat. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm... Thank you, Deborah. I will check it when I go in the house. Mm -hmm. Oh, you're 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 never a brat there, Pat. Oh, Glenda's good nighting. Okay, good night, Glenda. Who's good nighting? Good night, sweetheart. Well, it's time to go. Uh, yes, areas of some of them seem a bit crooked. Oh, I just stared me blind. <laughs> no, they they. So I do see that actually. Once you said something, I thought, well, mine kind of. I thought I was doing okay with mine, but 
We'll just we'll just do the best we can, and we're just gonna uh, applique around with a zigzag or a blanket stitch or whatever. But this would make a great little, um, even a kid kid quilt, a little something to set out at the beach or a little picnic blanket for one sort of thing because it's only like thirty one by thirty six, so it's not like overly huge. It's about as wide as here and then as long as the desk. So. Yes, exclamation enter and enter. Okay, so we've got two done so far. Let's uh, get cracking. Let's try and just, uh, we'll just piece a few of them together here. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry. Do, do. Oh. What? What? Hey, coming over? Hey, what you got? Come up here. There we go. No, no, up, up. Up, up. There you go, good girl. Uh, they were a gift to me uh, from Miss Allison Johnson. She's one of the moderators of her channel. She gifted me a few kits because she knows it keeps me busy and I, I and I like doing kits and stuff like that. So and she's she's very generous. Come on. <laughs> yeah. It could be all fun when, to have them not all centers as as if just throwing. That's actually a good idea. They're die. I kind of like that. Just have some fun with it, right? Yeah, pretty colors, definitely. It's called, what was the charm packs called? One's low volume and the other is, oh, it's in my hands here, sorry. Uh, Solstice Ruby B, Ruby and B. She makes me smile too there, Tracy. Let me tell you, she's, she's my favorite. And that is a very neat idea for sure. All right, let's uh, wake the machine up. Cheers, everybody. I went in the house, made myself a hot cup of tea. Oh, she deserves it. She's even got extra goodies here that'll keep her busy a long time. Maybe not a long, long time, but maybe we, when we come back from lunch break. There, it's a, a bully stick, so that should give her a good long chew. So she's got those for us, for her today. <clears throat> what are you doing? You good? Hey, right. about daddy. Big stretch. Go on. Go on, good girl. I feel like I pushed the houses. I think I've lost fabric here. What's going on? That's how stuff gets, you know, crazy in the quilt shop. <laughs> it's like, what happened to the fabric? <laughs> I thought I was good to go. I am totally lost now. <laughs> Chris Hope, no, you don't need to re-enter. No, if no, you're, you're you're in you're in the pool. Yeah, if it says you entered, you're entered for the day. Yeah. Until we close the uh, the whole giveaway. Uh, this looks like water. <laughs> is that is it water? Yeah, no kidding, right? She usually thinks it's vodka. I think Sass thinks I have a drinking problem. Hi, Catherine. Unfortunately, you were well too you were late. You were too late. You had to be here within the two minutes. I'm sorry, darling. From when we drew your name to the time now on the screen, it's been, what, 10 minutes? Yeah. Yeah, sorry. I'm sorry. You might want to refresh, uh, Catherine. Because you, you may be way behind. Yeah, the chat, well, whatever should read is almost quarter to the hour. So. <sighs> Not sure if I did get it. So here it is again. Oh, Claudette, welcome, welcome. Yeah, you got it. Oh, sorry, Catherine, but you're about 10 minutes too late. For some reason, did you, I don't I don't know whether you're on the wrong. I don't, I'm confused. I'm confused. Unfortunately, we can't give an infinite amount of time after we draw a name because we don't know if. Uh, the person's still in the chat or not, and we, you know. Exclamation, enter, and that will put you in the, uh, 
in the queue to win. Okay, that's four. Yeah, also make sure you've got live chat selected at the top. Sorry, I feel really bad there, Catherine. I don't like it when things like that happen. Hello, Rose. Welcome to the chat. Hello, <clears throat> Lena. Welcome to the chat. Hello, Christine. Mm, I think the idea that my internet is very problematic. Uh oh. Well, you're out in the boons. Out in like wild country. <laughs> <laughs> wild Alberta. Where the squirrels run free. Well, I have 12 quilt designs now and just have to come up with the patterns for all 12 of them. There you go, James. That'll keep you busy for a while. And then start talking to quilt magazines and see if you can get yourself published in one of them. Uh, and not, oh, I'm sorry, Catherine, but it wasn't within the time that we were, we were drawing. You can go back through the chat and find, and I'm, I'm sorry. That sometimes the internet is a very trolly thing. Yep. Two, yeah, I actually had two minutes, um, to, to re respond. And then we have to, then we draw for another person who's, and for some reason your chat didn't come through until literally 10, almost 15 minutes later. And we have no control over that. Okay, did we have did we happen to miss her say something within I think Pop's going through the chat. Okay. And if you said something within the timeline and we just happened to miss it, we're sorry and I will reward you whatever you use it that you would like out of the, the five choices. And, and not not to worry, you'll still get the other one. If it's there. If it's there, yes. The other person who won. With Deborah, sorry. Just trying to think. Oh, oh did I miss one? Where'd it go? Oh, it's there. Okay. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. I was watching chat like a hawk. I did not see her name. Okay. Thank you, Munchkin. We we just wanna be fair and just so we're not trying to rip anybody off or anything else like that it's not not what we do it's not who we are yeah there was nothing between uh 11 30 and 12 o'clock sorry 11 30 and 11 34 when we redrew Uh, are you talking to Cindy? Is Teresa here or Tiffany or Stephanie or Ian or Sean? <laughs> Or, or, or is Miss Sobeka here herself? It's 
Sorry, Catherine. Sometimes the internet gets you. the charm pack it is wind hem fabrics and it's called solstice and ruby b it is ping mill blocks pretty much and they're going to measure about four and a half by four and a half in the end and then we're going to make a circle out of it it is very beautiful in fact thank you anonymous oh, it's quite pretty very and, and I'm glad they send you enough because it's their kit. It came with their kit. So they send you enough solids and enough patterns to make your pinwheels. And then they have the high volume to go where your beach balls go in on top of. Okay. It's pretty, and pretty colors in there too. So. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you, Anonymous. Big hugs. Thank you, thank you. Oh, Josie's got to go. Okay, bye, Josie. Later. All right, let's press these guys, and then we'll make all these little balls, and then we'll just keep going. I want to turn my... All right, let's do some pressing. proof welcome 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 to the chat hello Miss Teresa Louise I quilt too thank you Joellen what are you doing today? Oh, Joellen, thank you so much. Appreciate it. Thank you, thank you. It says to push towards the pattern part, so, of the fabric. Did you get your project done, Miss Teresa Louise? Or is that, was that question in my chat, was that for you earlier? I just missed it. I misunderstood it. I finished mine because it's hanging on the wall behind me. So that was the first one finished. Not bragging, just saying. <laughs> just saying. Miss Heather White, how are you doing? Thank you, Anonymous. This Anonymous guy, I tell you. Anonymous person. My goodness. There are many Anonymous with Thank you very much. How did your whoopie pies go, girl? Whoopie pies. They were looking good. Was that vanilla and chocolate? Like, talk about spoiled. <laughs> I'm kidding. It's his birthday. She did. She just needs to quilt it. This fabric I am pressing is going to be very hard to cut up. It's so pretty. Oh, it's got a nice print to it there, Miss Pat. Nice, nice print. All right, now we're going to make a couple pinwheels. Let's move these guys off to the side here. And we'll make a couple more beach balls like we're making. <laughs> Teresa's quite, yes, it did. It did. It turned out amazing. I saw her, she was laying in bed on um, so Becca's Zoom last night. So I, was, I guess she was having a rough, a rough time. Which is never neat. It is super cute, isn't it? Now we're just going to make a pinwheel with our blocks. And we're just going to trim off the dog ears that need that are affecting us in the center. And leave the one to the outside because when we trim it off, there's no point in cutting what we don't need to cut. So, yeah. Well, that's what I said. It was to, to 
was in bed. But I... Okay, maybe I didn't say that. I thought it. I thought it said it. <laughs> oh, uh, there we go. There we go. Starts pressing it all. There you go. Beautiful. Oh, you mean, no, she was in bed. Okay, yeah, yeah I gotcha. I'm sorry. I, I, was, I was like, did I say something wrong? I just I just took it differently. My, I'm sorry. All right, so that's one little pinwheel. She's pretty sick. Uh-oh, that's not good. Also under some healing thoughts. And another little pinwheel. Oh, where's my other guy? Oop, let's go press that one. Oops. Get it. All right, let's just sell those three together. <laughs> Such violence. <laughs> Yeah, there's lots of free ones uh, for designing quilts and stuff. So there's some ones you pay for too. So hello, pedal closer. <laughs> Pat's like, bring it on, sass. <laughs> Hold on, I think I got myself all turned around here. All right, here. Oh no. Try this again. Okay, there we go, these two. Well, it looks like the rain's kind of held off so far, but the skies are getting gray, and we are in for a storm, so if we happen to disappear later this afternoon to this evening, you kind of know why. We're in for 110 plus kilometer hour winds and rain, so. We do have our generator, we have plenty of water, we got plenty of food, so. We, we are well looked after. Got plenty of cooked food in the fridge too, just in case. We're obviously hoping things don't go hairy canary, obviously. So, all right, let's take these apart and then we'll give them a little press. Two. Oh yeah, we'll we'll do our best, but like we're we're we are prepped. Like if something happens, we're 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 good to go. Okay. So 
we made sure of that the last time we had a big threat of you know high winds and possible power outages because other parts of uh, Nova Scotia had been uh, out of power previously and and sometimes was out even though we had some so but uh, no we're good we're good you know the generator will do the uh, water pump which does the propane which heats the house and then we have water still and that's that's pretty much we're we're good to go even though we we have bottled water as well bottled water as well yeah, i hate to tell you we didn't get the water pump wired correctly to go into the oh. thing oh so fun stuff then well, yeah. now's a good time to tell me oh you know hey <laughs> the electrician was supposed to be here yesterday remember yes oh i do Okay, now we're putting these together in our pinwheel fashion. Okay. Oops, sorry. Mm. Hello, Angel. I'm sending the snow to New Mexico. We need it. It's going to be, oh, I, yeah, I heard parts down there. You guys normally get a certain amount of moisture by this time with the winter, and uh, you haven't gotten it, so it's going to be a very dry summer for you guys. I feel bad. I feel bad because it's going to be, you know, bad for the animals, bad for the people. You're going to have to have your water shipped in from somewhere. I checked my lotto ticket. I didn't win. I was very hopeful with the cashier too. She says, can I help you? I said, I'm just going to use the checker. I said, I want to know if I'm going somewhere sunny that some guy is going to serve me drinks or I'm going to go home and cry. <laughs> she starts laughing. I'm like, kind of serious actually <laughs> I was really hopeful <laughs> yes you guys too fill the bathtub with water for the back of the toilet yeah we usually got buckets got buckets to, to fill up so yeah definitely definitely there's there's two buckets in the bathroom if they're not filled up they were um, Munchkin was instructed to fill them up, so I'm sure he would get them done or he's got them done. So I heard Pop ask him beforehand, so. Yes, and speaking of Munchkin, we have a very fun project that him and I are going to take on. And that gives Pop a break from behind the wheel. It'll just be Munchkin and I. And then Pop will be busy uh, after a break. He can... Um, he'll be uh, getting stuff prepped for the kitchen. So, sunny day here in the UK, very nice. I'll take that. Uh, last two days here were very sunny and nice. It was gorgeous. I didn't even mind doing a dump run yesterday because <laughs> it was so nice. I even had the, the uh, uh, what is it, the moon roof? The moon roof down. Okay, let's press these three that we got done. And then we will use our template and make our circle in the center and then cut it out. And I'm more comfortable with tracing the circle and cutting it out with a pair of scissors than I am spinny winny with the rotary cutters. So you do whatever is comfortable for you at all times if you're not if you're uncomfortable doing something go then do it another way because sometimes that just leads to injury because if you're uncomfortable with it you're going to make mistakes and last thing you want is an accident with a rotary cutter some of you ladies in chat can attest to that <laughs> <laughs> we still have snow too, but there's lots of grass patches as well, which is what I'm excited for. I'm excited for the grass. I'm excited for the plants. All right, there's my TT. All right, just put that over there. What iron are you using now? Does it get as hot as your other one? No. And it's just a Proctor, cheap uh, Proctor Silex. It was like $15. And I just, I don't I know. I, I, I asked 
uh, what people would recommend as one, and I just I haven't, I haven't decided on exactly what I wanted yet. Okay, so placing that, I'm going to go from the back side because I figured if I happened, even though you're going to zigzag the bejeebies or applique the stitch at, uh, around this as much as you can, um, you, you're going to cover probably any any marks if you happen to leave it. But trying, I'm. It seems like the word martingale here is like in the center of the block so I'm kind of lining up the top of the letters with the round and then just kind of making sure I have a good half inch on either side of around the ball here and then just tracing it with a pencil okay and this works the same thing Masking tape, duct tape, you all got duct tape. I know you got duct tape. Everybody got duct tape. Or masking tape. Or even a, a, a glass that's the same size. It's literally a three inch square. If you look at it in the template here on the on the board, got one, two, three by one, two, three. Right? Okay. So there's that one, and we'll cut that one out. Just trying to make sure it's as about center as possible. And maybe on some of those darker fabrics, if you can't see the color the, of a pencil, then maybe use just like a white chalk marker or something. Okay, this one here. Make sure I got it as about center as I think I, I can. Okay, now we're going to take a very sharp pair of scissors. Oh, Ellie, okay, because I need to time all my buttons. Come on, I'm sure I get to the keyboard fast enough. Be back later, just watch. Okay, no worries, my dear. No worries. I'll give you extra time. Because <laughs> you let me know. Oh, we're giving Carol an extra minute, too, because she was going to be in another room. Now, if you tell me you're going to the grocery store, I can't give you an extra 20 minutes. I'm sorry. <laughs> it is the limit. Okay. There's the beachy balls. Bouncy, 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 bouncy. Gravity fed iron. Interesting. I think that's what happened to your last iron. Yeah, it was it, gravity the fed. The gravity felt it all right. <laughs> we had grass yesterday, heavy snow all day today. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, my girlfriend's is like, they're always canceling the bus. I think I think you get a little bit more oh that's a little wonked a little bit more precise and then I go out and totally mess up that one there we go much better so if if okay hear me out here if you wanted to do this as a uh, Stitching with a foundation, uh, like, you know, um, muslin or something like that, it's going to be hidden. I would make your circle come almost all the way up to where your um, seams are meeting in your four and a half by four and a half, because you're going to use that extra sp space as seam allowance, right? If you wanted to do that way, that way, instead of using, like doing it like the, not necessarily a yo-yo method, but I'm trying to, you guys were talking about it earlier and I forgot the name of exactly the, the you know, logistic name of it. So, um, 
but I would do that. Allow seam allowance, at least a quarter of an inch to maybe even a little bit more uh, all the way around. And then you can cut that circle out of that or find something that's that big and then, you know, cut in the, mus in the muslin in the back and the like little X and then pull it through and then make all the little uh, circle nice and pronounced with a, so it wouldn't be raw edged, right? So that would, that would be, that would be my suggestion. Yeah. Is to do it that way. You can almost use the outside, depending on what size your your tape is. You can use the outside edge instead of the inside edge. So, I don't know, just at that. Um, what was the was it? No, just stop. <laughs> we waited for you. <laughs> no worries. Gwenny was uh, um, able to join our Saturday, or sorry, Tuesday, Tuesday cross stitch chat. Normally, she's working at her little um, local quilt shop, counting the books and working behind the. the I'm assuming working behind the counter and stuff like that too. So, but she was snowed in, and then the neighbors came and plowed her all out. So she was so she was excited to hang out with us, but she was excited to get plowed out too. <laughs> As I could, I could totally attest here. It's nice when they plow comes. You're like, yes. <laughs> Yeah, otherwise it'd be really tiny. So could you imagine? It would just be this, like, yeah, it would be the tiniest ball. But that was not a bad idea if you wanted to just put all your background squares together and then you're bouncing the balls all over. Like, they could go in between seams. They could be halfway in a square, you know, like that. sort. Of, that would be kind of a fun idea, too, you know. Be experimental and always have... Ha have a pattern inspire you to make something else or inspire you to, oh, maybe this would work or that would work or, you know, why not? Welcome back. It's been 40 minutes already. <laughs> and then we'll just stitch around this doing a zigzag or a blanket stitch or, uh, yeah, the only limitation is your imagination. And I've said that right from the get-go of us starting to film uh, videos and stuff like that, so... I've, I've always I've always said that and that's how I learned it somebody told me the same thing the only limitation is your imagination and since I wanted to be a puppeteer I used to make all sorts of fun little puppets and stuff like that when I was a kid and that really inspired me just to be wild and crazy and do whatever no, no, no one says there was any rules okay for this one because there's a line on the diagonal it looks like school paper you know doesn't it kind of look like gold lines, lines, gold paper? And then I want to make sure, because it's kind of on the, I, I wouldn't mind one of these seams kind of being as close to, the, on the di that diagonal as much as possible. At least close to it. I think it would look okay. It doesn't look centered though. Oh, put it that way. I'm going to ask what stitch you would use. Well, yeah, well, you could use a, a variety of stitches, really. You could, if you wanted to, um, this would be the part you would sew together. And then you can come back to here, and you could do, like, with um, floss or embroidery thread, and then do a blanket stitch all the way around this. But it will fray in between. So I would do a, either a, a, a smaller machine blanket stitch or a zigzag for her. Yeah, center paper. Yeah, exactly. Look like a pen, 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 pen. All right, there we go. There's another one for the pile. There's another one for the pile. Did you ever think that when you started this channel, it would take off as great as it did? No. Yes. <laughs> you asked for honest answers. You're getting honest answers. <laughs> it really depends who in the house you ask. I think Marcus and I both felt that there was enough of a personality. Yeah, exactly. Um, that we would be successful. So that's what we thought. Edit. <laughs> I even said to them, are you guys sure about this? No one's going to watch this nut job. No, no one. No one, no one, no one, no one. And I, I literally felt like they were not necessarily setting me up for, for failure, but they just seemed to have this, this dream. And I was like, mm, 
okay, whatever you say, let's, let's go, let's try one, oh, let's try it. So that's how it kind of ended up. <laughs> sure, let's give it a go. Why not? Let's hop on. Choo choo. <laughs> And I was like, oh, I don't, I don't know if I could do this. And they're like, yeah, you can. And I'm like, I get nervous talking in front of like two people, you know. But <laughs> they thought they, <laughs> they thought so. And then I came along. <laughs> <laughs> uh, nothing but trouble, but we love trouble. We, we like our own kind. Oh, thank you, Nancy. I, I'm just me. You got to take me or leave me. Like I said, some people would just rather leave me. <laughs> On the side of the road. And some would take me home and feed me, which, you know, I really, really, really like those people. <laughs> they are my people. <laughs> which is dangerous after midnight. Yeah, it's like gremlins. Danger after midnight. I love heat and bond for applique and then a zigzag age. Well, I literally did. I thought about that too, Heather. I'm like, well, maybe we should app, like heat and bond these guys at the back and then put them down. But I'm like, you know what? Nah, just, just do her. Just get her done. Do what the book says. Gwen, you can't blame us for whatever happens. Oh, 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 oh. Is there blame going on here? Yeah, Is there finger said, pointing happening? She said you were my first YouTube experience. So we <laughs> can't control the chaos that happened after that. <laughs> What did Kelly say? Was that diagonal line supposed to be offset? Yeah, because it's not on. It's not right on. Like, it's not completely diagonal. Look at that. It's oh, sorry. off. Uh, no, no, go back here. It's you can see that there. It's see? how it's printed. Yeah, it's how it's printed. So I was trying to see if I could get this seam as close to it, but it was moving it too close down into this corner, making it, yeah, so I'm like, eh, shiver up a bit. So. <laughs> Well, I, I, I appreciate your first YouTube experience. I searched for quilting shows, and I was ill, and he wanted to distract me. He, he fell in love with me. Whoa. <laughs> I appreciate it. Thank you. I, I usually I use more of a blanket stitch than zigzag. I, I like it, too. It's, it's, it's depending on the craft, right, or what you're trying to do. So how many years have you been on this adventure? Six. Six years. Yeah, we just celebrated six at the beginning of February and over 900 videos. So. Just a bit. Just, just a wee bit. Oh, thank you, Linda Lindsay. I appreciate it. We have fun here. Or at least we try to have fun. That's just who we are. And I even said to, said to Pop and the boys, like, I can't, you have to, they have to accept me for who I am and the quirkiness and the weirdness and whatever, the strangeness and, oh my gosh, what are we watching here? Because there's going to be some of that, right? And I know I'm not for everybody, but I do try and have fun and have a good time. And, and I try not to offend anybody. Uh, I try to keep a, a, a positive chipper kind of attitude. So, or I try to, you know, sometimes things get you down, but that's, is that rain? Yeah, it's probably oh, starting. Rain? Oh, yeah, it sounded like it. And I said, you know what, I'm just, you're going to have to, to, they're going to have to take me as I am. And that's it. I can't be anybody else but who, who I am, so. And we're happy for everybody that's come along. Oh my gosh, are we ever. You guys have enriched our lives as much as Very we, much so. we've tried to enrich yours, so it's been great. I have learned more from you than I think, than, than anybody, like from, from you guys as, as the, you know, viewers of the chat and. And people who love and support us. Right up your alley. <laughs> Watched you. I thought, what the heck is this? And of course, became immediately addicted. <laughs> what is with this crazy train? I'm Everybody getting on board. Everybody loves a train wreck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everyone loves a train wreck. Hey, wait a second here. <laughs> well, that's exactly Nancy. We teach each other, right? I think more than anything, our goal has been to build a community that we're proud of mm. and we, you know, can handle being around. 
there's so many negative environments in our lives that this has become our safe, escape. Yeah, our safe place. It's our, our safe place. Yeah, it's our, it's our fun spot. You know, we know we know when we come and we we hit those cameras and they go on. It's 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 our fun time. We're having fun with you guys. You know. Oh, thank you, Donna Riggs. Thank you to everybody. You know, really, I we really really do appreciate it. You know, all the people who subscribe and thumbs up and. And just, you want to come and have a good time. That's who we are. And yeah, we have off days. I have off days too, you know. Have fun at work, Sherry. Oh no, Sherry's at work. Mm -mm, I feel your pain, girl. Okay, we'll be here when you go back. Or on break time. Maybe. 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 We don't know when she works, still. No, that's true. You could be working like a 10-hour shift. What's good, my peoples? You're good. That's what's hap That's what's good. Now that pinwheel could have been maybe a little bit better in the center. I, I don't mind showing that. Could have been a little. Could have a little bit better. <laughs> that's all right. Well, that's good. No, there shouldn't ever be any judgment. The only person who should be judging you is God. So, but then again, we don't talk about religion or politics here. But I'm just saying. There's so I, I love Angela M's comment. Well, when I first saw the show, I could I couldn't. Someone, sorry. Show I couldn't. Someone could be more positive than me. Then I found you were Canadian, and I was. Oh, that makes sense. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Felt Canadian. <laughs> or just happy go lucky. Life is meant to be lived. It's too short. So you know. You live every day. You die once, right? So, listening while I sew. Very nice, Sherry. Thank you. Watching live streams get me in my sewing room. Just love everyone here. <laughs> get into the groove of things. Exactly. There's a bit low on that ball. Yeah, a little bit, maybe. <laughs> At least in the center, it's a little flat. All right. Now let's uh, let's do a little zigzag stitch around the ones that we have here. And see where there it puts us for timeline wise. Amen, brother. Exactly. <laughs> Just needs a bit more air. <laughs> Somebody puff it up. <laughs> All right, let's let's uh, first grab a scrap. And I found this in my uh, charm pack, so I was hoping they didn't count this as one because it's 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 clearly not one. So uh, let's find a happy stitch. Hold on, I need to move my tape here for a second. It's going to go a little crazy on your screen. Sorry. So I can see what I'm doing. I want to make it wide. So I'm going to go about four. And I don't want it too close together. But I don't want it too far apart. It's going to take forever. So I'm going to go down to one. And see what that looks like. Let's see what that looks like on here first. So let's fold it over some before we start stitching around our block. Let's see if we're happy with this stitch out. I think that's gonna be perfect. Can you guys see that? It's very hard faint. to see. It's hard to see. Okay, but it's gonna be good. It's gonna be, it's close enough. It's not gonna really fray that much Maybe underneath. Maybe go to the overhead. To get a wash. Sorry? Maybe go to the overhead. Oh, sure. That's a bit better. Yeah, there we go. That's good. Okay. Could you? Oh, you totally could. You totally could. But I think I would do that in this form. On this form, there, Linda Lindsay. I would put that circle of batting on here, and then. Or put that square batting, and then when you're doing the zigzag around, for sure, then trim. Then trim that out. But that would look super cute. That would totally make those balls bounce. That's a, that's a really cute idea. You could even... I was going to say maybe layered. Not like, all of them. 
Hmm? Do some of them. Some, not, not all, all of them. Or even some more in others. Mm -hmm. So it looked like more they were po almost popping out of the block. Like uh, like a coin stack. You know how you yeah. do a coin stack bigger to smaller? Mm -hmm. Doing something like that with the batting, batting coins pretty much in yeah, there. Yeah, essentially. Yeah. yeah, it's a good idea. But all right, make it happen. <laughs> what I was saying is each one of the different circles you do at different sizes mm -hmm. yeah you could oh as and even balls. down to none oh okay so you'd have a different texture across the entire top that's a good idea love that uh the stitch length was uh 4.0 and then 1.0 so it was four is the width and the sorry yeah four is the width and one is the the length okay Big bouncy balls, baby. <laughs> okay, we're gonna start on the outside edge. And whenever we stop to turn or pivot or move our circle, if we have to stop it, we gotta stop it on the outside. Make sure that, that needle's on the outside edge, not on the inside. You guys are amazing, or you're real, and I absolutely love the humor. Oh, thank you, Lana, I appreciate that. I really do. And thank you to everyone else here. So many incredible and, and fantastic crafters. And when I've met so many crafters through this channel and uh, I, I appreciate like hundred proof. She's got, she's got videos out on YouTube, you know, um, Teresa Louise, practically creative, practically creative. You know, there's lots of, there's lots of you that, you know, do streams and stuff like Kelly uh, quilts and crafts and cruises. <laughs> You know, it's a, we're a very encouraging community and it's the, it's the amazing uh, love and support that one feels, right? So I tried so hard, so hard. Robinson, thank you. Seth, I, I, I was mentioned, I mentioned her earlier. Um, um, and, and Kathy Quilts and Crafts, there we go. Another one. And T quilts though, and to, Ellen Campbell. Sorry. To Cynthia's comment about oh, oh, oh. that we don't try and sell things to people, that's not a hundred percent true, and it probably won't be true in the future as we try and expand our business. Um, we may have, you know, things available for you guys to to purchase. We have our merchandise, and uh, you know, who knows what's going to happen in the future. So I don't want everybody to run away screaming and, and crying but um you know we have to expand our business too so i'm not going to say it's always going to be the same but hey it is what it is right now so many videos over the past few days just trying to chill out that oh carol lawrence how you doing uh you know i can actually answer that question but we'll do that when we come back from our lunch break <laughs> that'll be in a little bit um uh hold on well, i need to go back up oh 100 i was trying to figure out what video i was watching of yours the other day and i i watched you i really wish i could remember you were working on <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, ah, brain fart in here. <laughs> yeah, she kind of snuck in there, Marianne. She's a sneaky, she's a sneaky lurker. <laughs> I am too. I, 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 um, I, uh, lurk in Kathy quilts and crafts and she was working on a cute little project the other day. Mm. Oh, thank you, Lana. I appreciate that. Yeah, merchandise. Yeah, only if you want to. I mean, team chief. Oh, Carissa, welcome, welcome. You all saved my husband's life. Lifetime channel was my go-to before <laughs> I stumbled upon you guys. Some shows where women trying to murder this. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Rip headphone users. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> 
That was funny. I mean, Bob used to say, why are you always watching murder mystery shows or, you know, killers or something? I'm <laughs> like, yeah, that's what's on, you know. Uh, Elkie, I want to tell you the first time I seen you was in an interview with Leah Day. Oh my gosh, that was years ago. Since the time I watched every video and like it very much. Best wishes to you. Oh, thank you, Elkie, for being such a longtime supporter. That's, that was a long, that was a lifetime ago almost. Mm-hmm. Good luck. Uh, did the block shrink after stitching the ball? Good question, Lisa. Lisa, hold on. Let's let's uh, let's uh, take this uh, measurement day. Um, fraction? Nah. You know what? No, I don't. I don't think so. They are stacked one right on top of the other. There. No, it wouldn't have come in that much. I don't think so. I don't think it would have come in that much. So. Well, I had longish hair, yes. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Kelly's Cruises, as far as the merch goes, we will be doing some new stuff soon. Yes, yes. We got the plans. Oops. I just, you know, and, and, and thank you to everybody who's hit that sub button and coming along with this, you know, awesome adventure. Because we wouldn't be us without you. And I, I'd say that a thousand times. I will say, though, 48% of people who watch our videos aren't subscribed. So what? if you could click that button, it doesn't cost anything. We would really appreciate it. It helps us. It does. Mm -hmm. We're so close to 27,000. Mm -hmm. So close. We're then, then it's close to 30. And yeah. then it's close to a million. <laughs> 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 yeah, I can't see that happening, but you know. Our main goal is to get the 100, right? That's... Uh, that would be lovely in our life. I was hoping we can reach 30,000 by the time we celebrate 30 years married. So, and since we're coming up on 27 this year, <laughs> we have a few years <laughs> to reach 30,000. <laughs> Thought that would be a nice little goal. Hello, Damali, how you doing? Oxen Hill, MD, Maryland, right? Just watch Eric's first live. Very nice. Check replay later. Okay. Mm. Oh, is it your for Leah Day? Uh, it must have been must have been seventeen. I thought it was eighteen, early eighteen. No, I think it was early seventeen. And it was well, we and it was fans of our channel who recommended us to her mm -hmm. to have an interview with. So thank you to the and I, I I wish I could remember who it was. I had it written down for the longest time. There was a few of you. There was a few of you that recommended us to Leah Day, and I that was very, very pleased. I couldn't believe when she contacted me. I was like, hello, is this for real? <laughs> it was like, whoa, one of the queens of quilting, and she just emailed me. What? <laughs> Are you kidding me? And she's such a creative artist, too. Yeah, I was a big fan of hers. Mm, sweet bread, yummy, yummy. I'll take some. Goals are always good. Yes, they are, Deb. <laughs> you got to have something. Thank you, James. Speaking of coffee mugs, I'm drinking coffee out of my mug uh, from you guys. There we go. <laughs> Very nice, mine. Oh, she's very talented. She's very talented. I was trying to figure out what you were doing. Coffee table and couches. What? Mode? Mo mo modi? Modded? What? <laughs> Moed. Moed. I'm like, mmm. <laughs> That's like bat. <laughs> bat what? <laughs> bat crazy? Check. Done. Been there. Done that. <laughs> it's on the list. I think if you did this zigzag stitch in a complimentary thread <laughs> to each beach ball, that would be... Oh, it was. Okay. Pop was right. Thanks, Kelly A., for proving me right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, does anybody remember Top Hat Pop? 
<laughs> gonna have to find him. Yeah, yes, you'll have to find Top Hat Pop before you wanted to be on camera. Mm. <laughs> yeah everybody check your uh, subscriptions a lot of subscriptions dropped off uh, a we lot of different we noticed that channels. on a few of the mom and pop quilt shop channels subs pop said that we weren't subbed to sobeka and i'm like oh yes we were and we've been subbed to sobeka for a very long time yep. and then there was a couple other ones we realized we weren't uh, for some reason weren't uh subbed to either for some reason i'm like uh we've subbed what's going on here so yeah, it's, it, it's they they were doing some cleanup, I guess, and uh, th they being YouTube. Mm, gotta wear the gear while watching. Oh, oh, what's going yep. on, Tracy Quilts? What am I missing? She's wearing your shirt. Oh, oh, well, there we go. Oh, there we go. That's nice little ball. But I'm saying, if you did it in this complimentary color. <laughs> <laughs> It usually gets me into trouble because, uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, when she's giggling, there's trouble. <laughs> I got dropped from Teresa's recently. Oh, yeah, interesting. I was wondering what happened. There was a few other like, other uh, streamers I watched, too. I'm like, I'm sure I'm subbed to you. And I'm like, go and I find them, and they've got, like, two videos out. And I'm like, what's going on? Yeah. So. Uh... Yeah, you, your subscribers are going to go up and down daily, uh, Hunter Proof, but uh, you should be able to um, see large drop-offs when they do these types of uh, clarification uh, as to... It, sometimes what it is is somebody will disappear for a couple of months and not watch one of your videos and they'll be unsubscribed. So just go ahead... Just make sure when you're looking at the channels that you want to see that they're still in your subscription list. And the bell. Right. And don't forget to click the bell. And then you get notified too. Treasure Heart Creations. Real cute. I like that one. I really like those colors together. <laughs> She's got itch. She's got an itch. We have a laptop. Okay. Interesting. Yeah, I know. We I meant to say that actually last Saturday. We were talking about. I think we just got all wrapped up with Sobeka's, what everybody had going on the Friday night before. And the fact I actually made it to, you know, the wee, the wee dark hours. <laughs> hey, I did offer to make french fries last night. It just wasn't at 1 a.m. <laughs> it was more what, 10? No, I, I don't even think I made it to 10. No, it was. I didn't even make it to nine because I wanted. I tried so hard to stay awake for to say hi to Miss Sobeka last night, and I was just so I watched a little bit of the replay this morning. That's how I knew about Tiffany not feeling very well. She was in bed. There we go. Cool. Bouncing. These to be cute, all put together. Right. See what our see what a little uh, row looks like. There we go. What do we think of that? It looks kind of cute. I never received offer of right now. <laughs> I didn't make any. Nobody took me up on it the first time, so. I like that minty green too. It's, that's, it's, it looks really nice. I think it'll look good with this fabric here too. Hi, Chris. So. Hello, hello, Chris Morris. How you doing? Doo -doo -doo. 
Well, what are, are you cooking, cooking today? today? I guess mm -hmm. you're going to have to wait. Yeah, see. I need to take a quick potty break before we go for lunch break because I can't make it 20 minutes. So. Okay. Okay. What do you want to do? Let's either we're taking lunch break early. Why don't we do that? Just take lunch break early instead of taking yeah. two little break breaks. Okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Lunch break early. <laughs> so we will be back in 10, say, 10 15 let's say 10, 15 just to make sure 10 to 15 minutes We're and then we will break. have a draw not pineapple with afterwards. pizza no no pineapple <laughs> there's no pineapple in the house no pineapple right okay we'll see you in 15 peeps okay bye <laughs>
Hello, everyone. This, this munchkin, also known as Mark, is here. And also Mom. <laughs> no worries. <clears throat> <laughs> he don't look like well he does actually <laughs> if we could have ever made a spitting copy of pop and i <laughs> it's pretty much that that right there well him right there you won't see that oh hopefully you can hear us here as well no echo hopefully so this is what we just finished off just a few of these just so uh you can see them there just a, just a couple there's one i forgot to ziggity zig but we will get back to that after, okay? Okay. Well, right now, we're doing a giveaway. Those are the two ch panels to choose from. Well, when, then when they get the name, okay? Ready? 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 I'm ready. We are so ready. 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 Glenda Gard, please speak up in chat. Glenda, 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 Glenda. Hopefully I said your last name correctly. If not, uh, name butchering is free. Oh, Miss Allison, hello. Welcome, darling. Welcome, welcome. Yay, Glenda, she's got a response. She's got two minutes. You got two minutes. Miss Glenda, you got two minutes. Two minutes. <laughs> Just gotta speak up in chat. Miss Allison. Miss Allison. Uh, Katie Mary's house helping with the little one. Mm, get the snuggles on. Get the snuggles on. She's gotta say something. She's got two minutes. Two minutes. Uh, enter the other way, not the French way, Kathy. Who's here in the list of chat? Oh, Teresa Louise looked, so maybe she's not there. We had a mm. very good lunch. Yeah. We had some uh, Leftover chicken. Leftover chicken souvlaki. I made enough last yeah. night to make sure that we didn't have to fuss with lunch today. It was just like yeah. a quick warm up and then munch and we're good to go. There you I, go, girlfriend. I, I was going to have them nice and warm for us when we went on lunch break and then somebody went 20 minutes already. Glenda didn't um, say she said she was going somewhere. Oh, Glenda had to go somewhere? I think so. Oh, pop, pop thinks. Okay. Okay. All right. We will. We will. Hello, everyone. Hello, Tammy in the Crafting Disaster. I can relate, girlfriend. I can relate. If, if people are new here and don't know, this is Munchkin. This is Papa and I's uh, child. Good Hello. One. I am Munchkin. And he's my favorite. Try my don't luck my, on Buffalo don't Sophie Chicken. Hear that. Oh, she's my She'll favorite. She'll be puppers. absolutely crushed. She's my favorite puppers. She's pouting half half on the bed, half off the bed, because <laughs> apparently her her toy is in the middle of the bed, and I, you know, like she can't do something about that, right? Yes, you have a birthday in. What day is it? The twelfth. Ah, ten days. Ten days. And you will be. <laughs> well, that might have to 26, get a, have I'm pretty get a, sure. Get a foot and borrow some, <laughs> all of Sophie's paws and then so. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah. clears throat> all right, are we drawing some, somebody new, Medea? Is it that time? Hello, Polly. I haven't seen her. Okay, I haven't seen her either. Has anybody seen uh, a message from Glenda? And I miss, we and we just missed it? Apparently, Kelly's birthday is three mm. days before mine. I know. So, happy early birthday, if I do not get a chance to say it to you. Well, happy birthday to your granddaughter, Tammy Ann. Yeah, happy birthday to your, to your granddaughter. Ready? Yeah. Sure. Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
Betty Pollard. If you're in the chat, please say something real quick. Do 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 do. That was probably really loud. I'm sorry. I'm a good snapper. Betty, if you're in the chat, Betty Pollard, if you're in the chat, Betty Pollard, if you're in the chat, you can go all day with this, people. Come on now. Come on. Can you hand me a Kleenex, please? Thank you. Is she? Has she said anything? Got two minutes? Well, a minute and a bit. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. There she is! Welcome Yay! to Betty! We got a winner, winner, chicken dinner! So All right. you have two Three. options? Thank you. Three thank you, options? everybody. Thank you, thank you, big hugs. We see her. We, 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 we got it. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Do I play the spoons as well? No, but I did see something really cool on Facebook. It was like a, the cheater spoon thing. I told you like that. Okay, anyways. All right. On to your choices. Miss Betty. So we have this panel. Yeah. Uh, uh, we want to hold it or? Yes. Display. <laughs> well, this. I started to and then you went. I didn't need to press it. It came up. Uh, it's, it's upside down. Upside down. Okay. There we go. So you get, you get, you get um, uh, five choices. So you, you get, you pick, one pick of one of five. That's what I said. Well, okay. Sorry. Whatever. One of five. So there's this panel here. And make sure you send a um, uh, email to Pop and he uh, at info at wesowit.ca. And then there's this panel here. We'll show you sideways and because it's a long one. Don't don't worry about it. It's okay. Just pop it off to the side. It's just gonna get his name. We're gonna show it again and again. Okay, got that side. Okay. Right. That's okay. There's this one here. Beautiful. Uh, purple tree. Obviously, it goes this way, but sometimes it's all—it's hard to see it all on the camera. Yeah, I'm not going to be able to reach that. Okay. <laughs> there. I happen to be a little thing called short. <laughs> there we go. It's super pretty. I've done a couple of projects with that one. Or you can have a meter, and we have, we do, and I do a generous meter here because we're from Canada, and you don't have to pay for any shipping or anything like that. So there's this beautiful fabric right here. I'll move the panels off to the side. I got some beautiful batik. Brand spanking new still in the baggy waggy and this beautiful peachy pink. Also brand new in the baggy waggy. So you pick what you would like the panel or one of the panels or a meter of this fabric. One of the fabrics. Yeah, meter, meter of one of the fabrics. Sorry. <clears throat> Clearly not wording properly. Hello, oh, Donna Richley. Welcome, welcome. Make sure you go exclamation enter to enter because we will still have more draws throughout the day. What would you, a, a blue panel with the tree? Okay, make sure when you send that email to Pop that you include with your address that you include the blue panel with the tree. Okay, because I don't want to mismail you anything. I've done that before, and it's and I it's my bad. I should make sure everybody puts in exactly what their choice was. Okay. Please do. Info at we sew it .ca. Thank you. Thank you, Pop. Thank you, thank you. All right. Now, what are we working on today, Munchkin? Well, we, I think that's down or this is down for them. I, I want to slide it in. I think that's right the way you're doing it is right there. Well, we have this. It is a really detailed owl puzzle that uh, that we're going to put together today. This one, Linda Frederick, or the petite? Sorry, just want to answer the question. If you allow, I'll buy a meter of the black and uh, pink, please. If I don't win today, oh well, for certainly, certainly, Deborah Davidson, no problem, no problem. Yeah, it, this is kind of my, my parents' birthday gift to me, and I decided that I'd like to share putting it together with you all, and, and that way I get to put it together with, with my mom. Mm -hmm. And it's a good size, too. Yeah. Okay, just, just back to Linda Frederick's question. This, this one, uh, yes, 
black. Okay, so this one here. It says Simply Natural. It's Northcott. Um, Northcott Studios to Simply Natural. The number is 22141. Is that correct? Is it, I'm reading it upside down. So is it 22141? 22141. Okay, 22141. There's also a white in this as well. Like it's a white on white and it's very beautiful. I have them both, but I don't have a lot of the white. That's why I didn't want to offer it up just in case. Of the black, this one here, Pat, for sure, for sure. All right, I have to make make a note of those two. I know, oh, ha happily, happily, happily. <laughs> All right, so we we've only looked at the puzzle pieces. Okay, we just looked at them just a little bit. We didn't try to put anything together, and these have animal shapes. Some have animal shapes in them. So. All right, Pop's gonna go take a little bit of a rest before he's gotta be busy, busy in the kitchen. Okay. Thank you, darling. So oh, mom's oh. being given power. Power of the bootins. You, leave, you, you trust us alone? I don't, but. By, hey. by ourselves? So nope. we press all the buttons at the same time, right? Yeah. Now I really wonder what that does. Well, there's, there's one button in the middle, and it says mute. <laughs> ah. <laughs> Try that one. See what happens. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and a meter of the white. Oh, the white one I was talking about? You betcha, Pat. You betcha, Pat. Mm -hmm. Did you bring your late note? Mary didn't bring a late note. I didn't see it. Isn't it cool? I think that's it. I make sure to get, I got him a cool shirt for today. Yeah, I do. I do. I do. Uh, we'll have we'll have a better uh, grip of those things coming soon, uh, Lynn, Lynn Bialis. Um, yeah, uh, but we're we're I'm working on it. We're we're doing the best we can. It's a, it's a process, but we're we're having some fun <laughs> doing it too. Okay. okay. Well, yeah. I'll see you in about two and a bit hours. I'll be around, so just okay. Poke so. me, and then we'll get set up for the secret uh, cooking thing that we don't know what we're doing. You, but we're do. gonna do it anyway. Dan Palmer, we found it on Amazon by a company named Unidragon. It was actually, I, uh, what was it, the wolf one I found first? And then I showed yeah. you, and then you're like, oh. And then I'm like, let's I go see what other. I saw in the recommended <coughs> that there was, was an, owl. Uh, yeah. an owl. And they have different size puzzles as well. Yes, yeah. and you can this, pick. Yeah. This is the royal size, which is the hardest that they apparently get. And the biggest. So this may take us a while. Secret cooking thing, oh boy, says Alice. Uh, <laughs> owls are one of my favorite animals. Uh, owls, yeah, all of them. Yeah. You seem to connect so. with them. Yep. Yeah, so the, the cooking today will be about something that has the word dump in it. Oh, <laughs> no. Are you trying to relive my trip to the dump yesterday? Yep. <laughs> that's where we got all the ingredients. Because <laughs> that's what came back. Uh, yeah, I did. I did. came back from the dump. I, I left with a full <laughs> car of dump stuff, and I came back with ingredients from the grocery store. It's magic. Maybe the grocery store. I don't uh, know. <laughs> Unidragon. Unidragon. One word. Uh, I'll put a link in when I get back into the house. I'll okay. I'll put a link in the chat. Okay. Thank did you, you bring much. anything to drink with you? Nope. Oh. I have made a... Error? Error in judgment. Why don't you go grab a glass? We got time. I can take some of this out. Uh oh, or you can have Dad's glass. Uh, thank you very much, Dad. <clears throat> and I do have uh, I have a jug out here. So, thank can you, you grab that the doggy treat? No, no. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, there we go. Oh, be careful. Well, since you're over there, you mind bringing over the cardboard that we're gonna build this on? Do we have, no, we can slide it. We can slide it on. Let's just build it on the table right now. Okay. We're fighting the that, that's... Okay. Is that okay? That's gonna... <laughs> I foresee this going poorly, but... It'll be fine. <laughs> Let it be said, I told you so now. <laughs> <laughs> this is a bully treat for Sophie. We're gonna go... <laughs> she knows. She knows. Come here. Sorry, just scoot over just a little bit. Come on. There we go. Is this for you? Yeah, you like that story. Come on. Come on. There we go. There's a good girl. <laughs> See? See? She's the favorite. I got to give up camera space for her. <laughs> the, yeah. <laughs> See? Love you, Dad. 
All right, so this is what we're putting together. It says 650 pieces. We don't expect to finish it today, so be patient with us. Uh, but we are going to try and have some fun. Um, it should measure 13, uh, almost 14 inches by um, 24 inches. So it's uh, it's, it's going to be a good size. Yeah, it's going to be a good size. So here's mm. here's 14 inches there. That's 20 to 34 right in there. And then it's going to be tall, so it's going to be a good size. You're going to want to scoot the stream deck over because this is the main workspace that's okay. visible in the top camera. Okay, here we go. So, you have that centered. Uh, okay, well, hold on. Maybe let's... Let's not mess with that. Or let's mess with that because that works. That works. That that, okay. Okay. that made it so my left hand's actually in the view. Well, I can scoot over too. So. I just needed to move the bolts of fabric. Sometimes. Ah, now I have more camera space. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah. Well, she deserves goodies too. Now she's too. I wish she was kind of chewing to, towards you, but you can yeah. see she's at least keeping busy. With uh, with every puzzle, they. <coughs> they send these little puzzle pieces of their logo, which is really cool. Mm -hmm. It's kind of clear. Yeah. All right. <laughs> now, here's here's some of the, the pieces. <laughs> okay, here. There's You can see a little squirrel there, a bird there. Let me just put a couple pieces so you can see the size comparison. So the 650 pieces of those. And of course this one, there's a squirrel on that side, but it's also the, like the painted, it's a squirrel on that side. Yeah, pretty cool, eh? <coughs> we're what, 30 seconds in and I'm already like, we're in over our head? <laughs> <laughs> I said I'd be happy if I found two pieces to go together. <coughs> Do it. Do it. Wait. I found a squirrel. Yeah, I know. That was the one that was in my hand. Oh. <laughs> well, I found a chinchilla. Uh, okay. Yeah, we will. We're, we got a piece of cardboard we're going to move it to and then flip it and then glue it. And then, yeah, we got it. We got it. It's, it's going to take some time. I like the way it comes wrapped. Like a little burlap. Can see, and the it is a box. From a company called Unidragon, on Amazon. Ooh, found a wolf. Okay, I don't know what these are for. They are the stands. Oh, the stands. For oh, that. right. That's right. We can remember that. Yes, yes, yes. So here. Set that up. We're going to need it. <laughs> I, I'm, oh, oh, found a corner. I found an edge. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. I'm going to get excited. <laughs> I found another edge. It doesn't seem too bad. Oh, here's a nice big piece. <laughs> Let's take that off to the side. Oh, my gosh. Look how tiny that is. Look how tiny that is. <laughs> you want to get your fingers in that? <laughs> sure. Well, you could do how, all sorts of uh, little fun things. How can we put this that will... They could see it? Well, if you turn it the other... Well, for both of us? Yeah. yeah. We'll just have to turn Because it we before. need it for the... <laughs> yeah. Well, let's spread the pieces out first. Get them all facing right side up. Yeah. That's that's the key point here. And any edges put off Ooh, to the side. Oh, found an owl in the owl. There you go. Score. Any edges put off to the side. Uh, that is right here. I found a starting point right in the middle of the owl. It's the owl. It's destiny. I feel like that was planned. <laughs> <laughs> Clearly it wasn't. <laughs> I like all the different little... You got leaves, you got fish, you got little just whirly whirlies, you got everything. Leaves and mythical creatures. and Here's another owl. Look at that one. Oh, isn't it cute? It's a tiny, it looks like a little little uh, barn owl. 
Oh, a little acorn. Yeah, so we're going to do this for, for a little bit. Hopefully you're hanging out with us still and don't miss anything. What are you doing now? Uh, we're, we're putting a puzzle together. We're putting this together. Hold on. I think I found a fence. Uh, okay. Uh, hold on. Let me go. It has me. little slats for a there fence we go. in it. We're putting a 650 piece. Uh, there we go. Pop just put it in the chat there, Eva. Yeah, we decided to get the hardest puzzle possible. <laughs> I found a pineapple. <laughs> <laughs> a little pineapple. <laughs> oh, you can't see it. <laughs> it's not in the pineapple. <laughs> All sorts is of that funny. A pile of hay? That does look like a pile of hay. I'm just finding an entire farm. There's many different animal shapes and plant shapes and, and like I said, and doodads and thingamabobs and whatchamacallits and stuff. You're the star. I think that's a leaf. That's a pretty leaf. Look at me the leaf. Half the fun so far is just finding what the different creatures yeah. and Well, I knew this wasn't are. just going to take today, but doesn't mean they can't come and join us on a, on another day and while we work on it. If somebody wanted to come and join us. It's outside piece, outside piece. Huh. They really make sure you're well supported. You can get different sizes in these two uh, micro projects. Uh, we chose the big one, which is the Royal, but you can get the same same size or same uh, owl uh, puzzle, but you could do it like um, 50 pieces, 300 pieces, you know, those sorts of things. So you set it up for yourself. I got the tiny one because I really just didn't want it to take us like 20 minutes to put the puzzle together. But I think I kind of overestimated our skills <laughs> on possibly getting anything done. So we'll see, we'll see. The, the fact is we're having fun. Yeah, and that's the, the main thing, that we enjoy some time and gives, together. And gives Pop a break too. So. But the whole, the whole puzzle piece for today is definitely is good fun. All right, come on, turn over. Next time. I'm actually using the stream as a... <laughs> this is one of the bottom parts of a branch. Two sizes, king and royal. Okay, sorry. King and royal king. Just got to be careful with the pieces. Some of them look like they have little, little extenders. Should they snap into the right spot? Yeah. Now, it's been a long time since I put a puzzle together, so. Many like, years. Like, long, long time. Long time. Half the time's just going to be flipping them over to be well, face Well, that's why up. I was trying to do that as quickly as possible. But there was no way to do that ahead of schedule, so... Oh, a bear. Oh, no, it's not. It's a raccoon. Oh. Looks like Sophie's enjoying her treat. Come on, let's see if we can. There we go. Oh, is that a good treat? Yeah. <laughs> give, her, give her a few minutes while... Uh, for a moment while we flip some pieces here. <laughs> she can enjoy her little treat. Everybody gets to see her enjoy her treat. They are real wood. Yeah, uh, they are. Yeah. Well, I, I think they're actually MDF, which technically is wood. That's it. I would say it. Yeah, they're a very fine pressure board. Like, they, they feel quality. Yeah. And you can tell it's laser cut, too. Definitely laser cut. Alright. Okay, Sass. Get comfortable. Don't worry. 
We won't show you any green. <laughs> well, I can't, we can't make promises. Like there that. isn't actually much green in this. <laughs> There's a little bit on the leaves of the branch. Uh, oh. And maybe yeah, and the bottom of the uh, exterior feathers. Oh, there's that piece. Okay. Where's your center bit that you saw? Maybe that goes there somewhere. That's the very center of, like, below the, like, mm. the head. Okay. Well, well, let's keep those together. They might be close to it. Ready to go? Where that's the tip of the beak, I think. Maybe. Well, that's why it didn't really sit that way. It doesn't really quite. Well, there's Maybe, well that's what I mean. There could be some more definitely pieces some in between. In between. Mm-hmm. So did you want to like pick a color s scheme sort of thing like this these these blues and I can try and take the ones that look like the little scales and then we can try and put together or how do you want to how do you want to work this there Chachi? I think we need to try and find different patterns and then try and find where that pattern continues. So if you want to start with the scales there is a lot of scales. I know. <laughs> Boy, the arms are too short. I don't want to miss chat, but we gotta, we gotta uh, borders for. I know I was looking. That's what I was thinking. Get the, those uh, edges. I got a few put well, off to the, the side here. The typical puzzle rules I don't think really work with this, because the sides aren't square. They aren't flat. They're all curves. Right, but we could get the edge. Right, we could get the try and get the outside edge and then work our way from there. We just have to find something that's a little flatter, flatter curved, right? That's why I have to bone these pieces off to the side. So let's try, right? Oh, oh yeah, she's really raining too. I, I can't reach those. Well, I don't want to ruin your, what you got going on, so. I got nothing going on. I've just been trying <laughs> to flip them over. <laughs> Whoa, 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 don't get too close to the edge, man. Right, oh, that's an edge piece. Oh, check that out. Oh. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah. Oh, actually, hold on. It's a cute little fox. Oh. Right, okay, let's show the other side. Sometimes it actually has the image and that doesn't. Well, kind of, sort of. A little, a little fox face. A little fox face. There we go. Uh, hold on, let me stand up and I'll flip those other ones over. Oh, I just didn't want to stretch. Yeah, thank you very much for warming up lunch. No problem. Appreciate it. And thanks for spending your afternoon with me. Thank you for agreeing to do this with me. Oh. All right, just a couple more to flip over. Found maple leaves. Found maple leaf? Yeah, there's a few maple leaves in here. I've seen oak leaves and a few other ones. I'm trying to get the edges. All right, tea's all done. Okay, I've put two pieces together. Yay! Well, you've accomplished more than what I was going. Well, no, you've accomplished what I was aiming for today. So I. <laughs> So nice score. These two together. Now I'm going to see. Show the chat. Show, show the chat. Open the mask. 
Please don't we count got them. two. <laughs> Celebrate! <laughs> Yeah, I'm I'm just going by, okay, this is the pattern, and it happens to be an edge. I believe I'm working on the log. There's another one that might fit my little pattern. And two more together. Nice. Okay, like, now he's just being an overachiever. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> Great job. I'm still looking for his edge pieces. You just keep building. I'll try and get all the edge pieces if I can. I think that might be a tip of the wing. Oh, tip of the ear? Tip of, tip of something. Tip of the ear, maybe. Oh, no, not the ear. The, the head feathers. What you looking for? Need that? Nope. No. I'm just looking for different pieces that. Uh, 625, uh, 650. Yeah. 650s. Sorry, if, or I'm so sorry we're missing chat. We're so focused on what we're trying to do. I have, uh, we have quite the, the owl collection ourselves. We like owls. He likes them very much. What you looking for? What you looking for? Can I get you? Roll the dice. Roll that dice. Just looking for a reference point. Okay. I think I found the start of one. Okay, so that's the the very tip of the tail. Which then leads into that. Oh, I got two. Oh, I got two. Nice. <laughs> Small achievement. <laughs> Am I going for three here? Am I going for three? <gasps> Blessed be, I've got three. Look at me. I've got three. I'm finding that my eyes are glazing over as I'm, <laughs> as I'm looking. <laughs> That's what I was like, trying, trying to maybe keep light things together. Hey, I just, I'm just happy. Are you kidding me? Okay, I found where this one goes. Nothing attached to it, though. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> it's like, oh my goodness. Because it's been a long time since it fell off. I'm like, oh, I put myself a lot of pressure here. Like, my. Like, oh my goodness, it's gonna happen. Well, you know what? I don't think that goes together. This one. I don't know it does. I don't think it does. I think I need these two. There you go. Yeah, I'm working on the yellow golds and a little bit of red. Oh, wow, the two pieces that I grabbed <laughs> just happen to go together. together. <laughs> Uh, they are not a match, though. Uh-oh. They, they just wanted to make me think they were. Mm. Because they are not smooth. Boiled. Yeah. Boiled again. Which makes me wonder if I did that. No, that one lines up perfectly, so that has to be right. With the pattern. I got my little section here. I don't know. Welcome back, Mike! Hey, hold, on. Let's hold on. Sophie is enjoying a lovely bully treat. 
Her back is to us, though. You can see the chinking I put in the floor of the extra batting I had. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very frugal around here. <laughs> I used what I had to keep the cold air out. <laughs> yeah, she's, she's, she's gnawing away on a good old little treat. Or was she? Oh, oh, she is. I was like, wait, she got off the cliff. This is still there for a moment. <laughs> mm. All right, now, Munchkin and I are trying to put this beautiful 650 piece wooden wooden owl puzzle together. Figured wooden puzzle. Yeah, so there's figurines, figures of animals and leaves and all sorts of stuff in here and they're puzzle pieces. Yes. I just wanted to let you know that she was getting looked after. She had her own set of treats too. So not too worry. We, yeah. we were spoiling the loafy. We usually do. Well, we try to. <laughs> She's a good girl. The table and have thick pure plastic tablecloth to go over them when not working. That's a good idea. That's a good idea. Maybe the, the next one we'll do at our table, our dining room table. What's up? A couple pieces. Do we got a narrow tip? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Ha ha! Yeah? Nice. Success. Okay, cool. Nice. I need to look at it. <laughs> okay, that's the bottom that's there. Right I've now. got the bottom piece of the center there. Okay, so we need swirls. No. Swirls coming into the center. And I think you're right. I think that, no, maybe that's not the beak. Yeah. Oh. Maybe. Up here, maybe up there, because it's got that little blue on the very, very tip tip, right? So, well, that's why I'm thinking if you see them side by side, yeah. at the very tip, there is the start of blue. Oh, okay, haha, <laughs> very nice. Look at you go. See, he doesn't really even need me here. I'm just like, you know. Decoration. <laughs> well, we got two That's pieces not together. Three. True. I got three pieces together, people, actually. Three. <laughs> Stop beating yourself up. Oh, celebrate good times. Come on. That is four pieces together. Do I hear five? Am I knocking on heaven's door? Hey, Mom. What? No. <laughs> it's not a competition. <laughs> It's not a competition. <laughs> Says the person that might be trying to make it a competition. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> uh, I kind of want that. I want to fit. Do you want to fit? Do you want to fit? Do you fit, fit, fit? Seems like you would. But then maybe Cute. you won't. I don't want to hurt you. Need another pointy nubbin. Pointy nubbin, oh boy. Pointy nubbin. Got three pieces here. Got. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I know, right? Five, six. <laughs> All done work for the weekend. Very nice, Mike. Well, welcome. Chillax. Chillax. And that is not from this section. It looks a lot like the owl quilt you made. You think so, Sir Perfect? Miss Lois, Miss Lois bought that. It hangs up in her quilt studio. It's not a competition. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, oh, that's right. right. Miss Lois has a question for you. Remember, I, I kind of teased at it and I got everybody excited saying you ah. had some good news and then I was, and then it wasn't my news to share. So. Well, I have gone from being a contract worker to full time. I am officially an employee. They like me enough to keep me. And I'm really happy about that. So are we. <laughs> no, we're very, 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 very proud of you. you. You know that. Thank you. I'm I'm really glad to end up getting to work with a company that I feel passionate about the project that we're working on and and the team itself is really enjoyable to to work with and they do good work mm 
Now, if I continue to be sappy, I'm going to cry. <laughs> no tears. No tears in puzzle making. <laughs> Only tears. <laughs> I feel like this might be one of yours. <gasps> it is. Just thank you. Thank you. And maybe this one, too. Yeah, probably. I'm working on a little section here. I'm starting with the edge. Don't mind me just solving your puzzle. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Sap talk. <laughs> tell me the tea, tell me real, real tea. Uh, what? Cindy put a message in there. Ah, uh, there. Needs to be hung on the wall. I agree. It's going to. And that to. is the plan. Yeah, this is, Mar um, this is... Marcus's birthday gift from Pop yeah. and I. They're the... not cheap. Let's just put it that way. They're not no, cheap. No, they are not. So. Uh, this is going to be the first piece of art that I have on my walls. Yeah, yeah. And hopeful, well, definitely not going to be the last. Cause, uh, oh, here's another tip we're looking for. Is it maybe Perfect. Not? It is a one. Yay! Useful. Ha ha. Ha See how much of it I've gotten put together? Nice. Very nice. Look at you I'm, go. I'm proud of that. <laughs> Good. The gloves I'm really are coming proud off. Of that. <laughs> yeah. well, it, that, it's all fun and games. It's, it is. It's just friendly banter. Until someone loses their race. <laughs> What you got going on here? Okay. <laughs> I know you wouldn't do that. I would never. Not on purpose, anyways. If it was an accident, then, you know. <laughs> here, look, found another one. <laughs> look, a distraction. Yeah, wrong hey, look, side of twins. the bird. I found twins. But look, they go in separate ways. Oh, that's probably a hint. Oh, okay, let's, let's keep those. Because, you know, hey. Set these off to the side so that way we can forget about them. Oh, yeah, we'd love that. Like, let's put it in that, you know, safe space. <laughs> oh, 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 look at me go, God Night Joe. What am I working on? What am I working on? It looks like part of the stick. Yeah. Very nice. We, we actually okay. both went. I didn't realize it was, but I knew you said starting, you were starting the stick, but I, that was weird. That was weird that we, uh, it ended up being the stick. No, I just went with the first pattern that I thought I could uh, match up together. Yeah. Oh, that's part of the face. Then put that over here. <laughs> then it's a sport. Exactly right, Joanne. <laughs> Accidentally on purpose. Oh, no, I tripped. <laughs> I feel like these are more stick than bird. So stick than bird. Yeah. Bird stick. Higher percentage of stick. Uh that's probably where the nails are. So the talons. Mm. It's probably here too. But I'm looking for the edges. I'm on the edge of glory. Oh snail. So, yeah, it's wooden figurines in the puzzle as well as it's a wooden puzzle. See how it's a cute little snail? What did you find? Is that one? Is that? Oh, I thought it was something. Okay. I'm just trying to find where this piece is relatively and it's on the top side of the stick. Uh, one that's got a, more of a flatter edge or uh, like a... Um, just more of an edge to it, like a straight edge. That's what I was kind of guessing at. That was the 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 pieces, like the ones that were a little bit flatter. You can see on like on the, unless they're flat. Well, it's kind of just I guess straight. So Vicky rolled his congratulations. Come, thank you everybody for all the congratulations to Marcus. We are thank very, you very, much. very proud I, of him. I appreciate it. It's it's nice to know that I have this kind of support. You got a whole internet family that loves you. I do, and I'm truly blessed. Yeah. Especially from a physical family. Aw, thanks, homie. You will get fed. No worries. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Can stop being sappy now. <laughs> no more sap. All right, come on. We got puzzle put together here. Crack on. 
crack a legging. Mm -hmm. Let's see what I can do with okay, one. Okay, that's the top of the beak. So if that's the top and that's the bottom. Deep, deep, deep concentration. Uh, Kelly, you missed me saying that I was hired full time for the job that I've been doing. Which means that I've been doing a good job. Yep. And they want to keep me, so that is obviously very good. Good. <laughs> yeah, that is an A plus very, all around. <laughs> I'm very happy that I get to continue working with the with the team that I really enjoy. Um, Pam Baker. These are stick. You know Pam. Pam. Yeah. Pam Crossing Guard. Pam. Yeah, she's in the chat there, and she says, "Congratulations, Marcus. You have come a long way. You deserve it." Thank you. We think so, too. Uh, what do I do? I am a, a video Trouble game... Troublemaker. <laughs> Candlestick maker. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> I, I work in video game quality assurance. Uh, and, it, and assist with uh, development. So he gets to play games... Yes, I get to play games, get but I also for it. <laughs> jelly. <laughs> it is work, but it's work that I enjoy doing. It is. It is hard work, but I and I know you enjoy it too. So that's that's the best part of it. It's also a lot of math and a lot of. Oh well, I, it ain't for me then. <laughs> You, you, you brought, had to bring math into it. Now, come on now. Yeah. <laughs> That's just for you, right? <laughs> yeah, no, right, right Mary? <laughs> yeah, paid for it. Rough life. <laughs> I, I don't know what to say. I'm being bullied. No, you're not being bullied. I'm sorry. You being feel that way. bullied. Okay. So leave it alone. <laughs> I don't mean to bully you. I'm sorry you feel that way. Anyway, I'm working on a beak. Okay, you beak. While I try and find more pieces for the tail. Pac-Man. <laughs> the light's glaring, so I can't see any of the patterns on it. Okay, well then stand up. That's what I was doing. I was just standing up and, and looking. I'm looking for any pieces. I still don't see what I'm looking for. <laughs> What's this? Oh, it's really coming down raining now. I think that's an onion. Uh, I some sort of plant thing? Well, I don't know. Some sort of foliage. Fol foliage and fauna. Flora and fauna. Yeah, practically creative. That's, that's one of my tasks. I can't get into too much more detail. As I am under NDA, but uh, 
is is definitely work, but it is fun work. Uh, the only hint that we have is the uh, is the guide, which we have and haven't been using. Ooh, this one is. Yeah, it's one of the eyeballs. And here's part of the other one. Huh. So that we might can, be helpful. And here, looks like this might be. We can put all the eye ones together and then just put them together later. Yeah, yeah. Uh, not sure about that one, kind of looks like. Yep. Okay. If it's got a large portion of black, the only portion, of, large portion of black, is the eyes. Okay. Oh, there's another top nubbin. Like here, here's a here's a fox or a wolf. So there's there's critters in the puzzle. Uh, 14 inches by 2 feet. So 14 inches by 24 inches. And it's it's a good size. That's why we thought it'd make a lovely wall hanging for Munchkin's face down in his, for his space. So. He's got lots, lots of wall real estate to hang things up. So uh -huh. he can start working on things and make things and like this. And I asked him, you know, I'm interested in this. Would you maybe want to do it? Um, uh, on stream and we can do it for your birthday. And he's like, yeah. So, and here we are. Because his birthday's in 10 days. Oh, I think the... Uh, that, oops. Maybe I shouldn't say that because that might be a later, later option for us. What we were going to do before we saw the puzzles. Oh, yeah, I still want that to be left open. So hush it, boy. <laughs> All right, then. I shall keep your secrets. Sorry, this is this is almost more distracting than uh, than sewing stuff. So I'm I'm sorry we're not as attentive to chat as we probably should be. But there's like shiny new objects on the table. <laughs> <laughs> we got to figure this out. Have you seen anything that's kind of round like that? find the, the piece that would go in here. Mm. And I'm not seeing it pattern wise. Mm. I think it's an animal piece because it looks like two little legs. Two little legs. Mm. Or two little danglies. <laughs> okay, two little danglies. Huh. They dangle. I'm not seeing anything, but there's a lot going on here, so. Hope everybody's having a great day. Hello, Mary. Good evening to you, too. Sparkles. <laughs> yeah. Hello, 70 Acres. I'm so happy that Sophie is helpful with the game. <laughs> she's, she's, she's chewed her toy. She's, she's or chewed her snack. She's done. She's out of here. I think when we went into the house at break time, she thought we were we were staying in. She's like, wait a second here. Where are we going? Are we going back out? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. Wait a second. I didn't plan for this. I had planned for a nap. <laughs> Do you have a chinchilla-shaped hole? 
Mm -hmm. <laughs> it just might somewhere along here. <laughs> when he gets towards the claws, yeah. I'm only at one part of the wood um, for the... Because I was missing a piece, and then I was like, okay, well, let's see if I can go find all the pieces that I can find that might go with this. And then it was like, oh my goodness, I got a lot more. So. I'm getting a little okay. chilled, so I'm just going to up the heat one okay. or two, okay? I don't want to be cold in here. Just because it's rained, it's chilled. So, for those of you watching, uh, right here is where mom is. And I am working on the three. I'm trying to do this in a mirror. <laughs> uh, I'm working on the three little bits below and also the beak. There's the beak. <laughs> Lots of swirls in this, like little hooks. I like the end. That's interesting. I feel like it's going to get much harder. <laughs> That's a little sparrow or dove? Yeah, I would say so. Oh, I have these flipped around. The rounded edges yep. there and the angled edges there. Okay, yeah, look at me. I'm building my wood. <laughs> I'm building my little wood, little wood, wooden tier. That goes there. Oh, it does. Look at that. Mm -mm -mm. Find the big one that goes up in there. No, oh. like that's um. one that goes over there. Thank you, everybody, for joining us today. We really greatly appreciate you. Mm, if you are cold, maybe you're not working fast enough. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> Keep a jog on. <laughs> oh, Joyce's got to go to work. Oh, have fun. Thank you for spending the time that you could with us. Yes, thank you very much. Greatly appreciate it. Uh, thank you, 70 Acres. It turned out really nice. That was the one we did on Miss Sobeka's um, chat last Friday night. Not the one that just passed, the one before. So, Boy, time flies, man. Had, had such a good time on that one. And she's such a great host. And she looked like she was having fun with some people last night, too. I didn't, I didn't get a chance to stay up long enough. I, I wanted to. I was just, like, my mind was exhausted knowing what we had going on here today. So, wanted to reserve energy for the puzzle. Exactly. I know I did. <laughs> yeah, I was actually happy to hear you uh, were up this morning before your alarm ha, as well. Ha. Very nice. Ha, ha, ha. Good job. Oh. Hmm. What? It fits. That. But that might be because I've put the wrong piece here. I was just going to say, maybe that doesn't fit. What? Whoa. Eh. Because it's supposed to go over here. Nope. Last night was fun on the Zoom call. It looked like it, they, they were having some fun, except for Tiffany. She was all snug and tug in the bed, but she was not feeling very well. So. Mary Ann's having fun hanging out with these guys while I sort through piles of paper. Oh, there we go. I'm going to keep you company. This one. Me and my older sister used to have puzzle marathons. <laughs> uh, it's been a long time since um, uh, we put a puzzle together. So I said this could definitely be a challenge, and there's no way we were going to finish it today. <laughs> 
but we would certainly give it a good and start. And I took that as a challenge. <laughs> we'll certainly give it a good good start. Try our best. <laughs> All we can do is give it our best. And I was right, it was an animal one. It was? Okay. Yeah. Very nice. I was watching a uh, good show. Um, uh, you might want to refresh there, Deli. And yes, congratulations to Betty for, for winning the panel. Well, what she wanted, she, she got to choose. So, um, but yeah, maybe you want to refresh. Make sure you're on live chat. You know how sometimes it says top chat and then there's that little drop down, little arrow. Make sure you're on, on live chat, live chat, live chat all the time. Um, what was I talking about? I don't know. My brain is puzzled. <laughs> Your brain is puzzled? Yes. Uh, I had a point, and I know I forgot my point. Besides it being on my head. <laughs> forgot the point of my story. Maybe if I went up the chat, something will trigger it. Mm -mm. Chocolate break? Yeah, I might need one. Oh, thank you, Valerie. Thank you very much. <laughs> the show I watched. It was called uh, Dance of the Birds. It's only 41 minutes long. It's hosted by Stephen Fry. I love his listening to his voice. Thank you, Valerie. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> the shiny object. <laughs> Woo! Um, uh, it, it was really neat because you get to see... Uh, the male birds, male birds are always so much beautiful with their plumage than the female birds, right? But seeing what they have to do and what they build and the dances they have and so on and so forth, it was, it was, uh, it was, I, I was entertained by it, let's put it that way. So I found, I found it was a good show. And when I'm entertained by a show, I like to share it. So, yeah, it, it was, it's a bird documentary. So, <laughs> Valerie saves the day. <laughs> a bird you mentioned. A bird you mentioned? Yeah. Ha, 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 ha. My original plan was to just have like a solid three hours of bird buns <laughs> while I was sitting here. Uh, and then Bob said no. <laughs> but Pop isn't here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> He's still watching. He's still supervising. I, I still think it would have been a hoot. A hoot. A hoot and a holler. And I'll stop now before. I tried to give a hint last week when I said, what are yeah. we doing? We, what are they doing? Uh, you mean us? We are putting together a puzzle. Mm-hmm. Put you out there, book. Thank you. Ah. <laughs> uh, it's Munchkin's birthday present. Yeah. That's not what I'm looking for, but that's okay. Yeah, it's going to take us a little bit, but... The main thing is, is that we spend time together. It is, it's a beautiful design. Yeah, and it will take time, but that's okay. It'll be worth it. I wish I could find what fits in there. Fits in where? Right here. It looks like a, a bird, like a, um, a talon, like a three talon sort of thing spread out. It's got to be like brown and yellow and brown. Brown and yellow and brown. Yeah. Brown, yellow, brown. It's got like a little talon. Sort of. and I'm, I'm, like, that's why I thought, thought I tried to pick up all the pieces that could have gone there. And, Sure, I'm just missing it here. Did you find it? No. 
Uh, no, I don't think it's too much color. Yeah, it's too much color for there. Thank you, though. I appreciate you trying. I think it is part of the claws, though. Yeah. So it might be useful to have over there. Okay, stick it up there. Oh, that's too much. Okay, enjoy, Vicky. Take care. Well, I need to break from seam ripping, so I will go for now and pop in later. Okay. <laughs> oh, boy. Have, have fun, Pam. Have fun. It's great to see you on, on live stream, Marcus. Thank you very much. Uh, he is? He is what? I missed that. I miss spending time with my son who is Phoenix, but I've lost 10 pounds from cutting down on my snacking. <laughs> snagging while puzzling. Puzzling while snacking. No, the puzzle doesn't fit into this. This is just a visual guide. The end puzzle is a little bit larger than uh, one foot by two feet tall. It is a good puzzle, so I'd make a nice wall decoration. L L that owl would be cool collage. It would. It would make an awesome, awesome one. Definitely. You're the expert at that. <laughs> so talented. Okay, that's good. Good, good. I was losing faith in myself there. I wasn't finding any stuff to put together. I was like, Ugh. You mean like I am? <laughs> yeah. It's like, this is, this is not making me feel comfortable right now. <laughs> well, that wasn't the goal. The goal was just to have fun. No, oh, I know, I know. Um, Pretty much so. This is the middle of the forehead. Okay. Like we about there? <laughs> yeah, on the bird though. <laughs> we about there? <laughs> so what's everybody else gotten on their day their day for today? Uh and, and reminder in about forty five minutes we're gonna have to um go to the second stream, right? We uh, we stream for six hours on the one and then six hours on the other. Because YouTube doesn't like us doing 12 hours straight or they take away our video. So, well, we've had that happen and it made us very upset. Is, is that an ESD or? Yes, right there. It is 2.14 Eastern Standard Time. Okay. It is 3.15 our time. Okay, thank you. Eight thousand piece one? Oh, good gravy! I don't think I could. I couldn't twelve hours. <laughs> twelve hours stream? Where is that? Where I don't know where. <laughs> Finished in a very special quote from my great grandson. Very nice, Jennifer. Very nice. And pop quilt shop. Watching from the farm. Headed to the house to sew and relax. Pony was bad. What whoa? What whoa? Did they try to escape? Is that it? What's up? I'm just looking for pieces. Sewing squares for a wedding guest signature girl. Oh, very nice, Laura. I like that. I'm on weekend number two of Project Clean and Declutter Sewing Space. Very nice. Weekend two. Can I put this to... I'm 
Starting my tails, block of the month. Oh, very nice. Very nice. Well, that's a lot. How big is it? Yeah, uh, that, yeah isn't it, Valerie? 8,000? How big was it? Working on mother-in-law quilt. Very nice. Beach balls, how many did you make? I think I have six or seven made so far. We'll continue it after. We'll do after Pop's done in the kitchen. But this will be an easy project to, to do. So it's super cute. So it's turned out really nice. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, one didn't get sewn around, but we did get six done. There we go. That should give them a better view on the mm. on the bird. Oh no! Sorry, Teresa. Wish your power would come back on. Oh no! I've got a six thousand piece to put together. Oh boy! Four and a half by six. What? That seems super, or is that a 600 piece together that's four and a half by six? Because that doesn't seem like it. Okay. <laughs> oh, wow. Well, at that size, mm. it's pretty comparable to this, I think. Mm. Oh, you're talking about me, Jennifer? Actually, someone else mentioned that I uh, wanted to know how much weight I had lost, so... Uh, when I had to go to the doctors, and that was in early 2020, I was 282. And the other day I weighed myself and I was 236. I'm very proud of you, Mom. Oh, well, thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Took a while. I, know, I got I got more to go, but that's okay. Thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, I've been not on the just trying to look after me for the past couple of years, really. So and doing it slowly so it stays off. You know what I mean? It's got to stay off. I don't want it coming back. No, no. <laughs> well, thank you, thank you. I appreciate it. And pop two pops dropped like 50, 60 pounds. I've gotten rounder. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Appreciate it. <laughs> Kick it out the door, you bitch. <laughs> Don't you come back now. <laughs> it's hard to shake it once you get it, you know, and, and I, I just didn't, I just wanted to be a healthier me and, me. and I didn't <laughs> want my knee to keep aching. It was, uh, it was hurting and I did, couldn't figure, like, obviously I could figure out what I needed to do. Drop a few pounds, but, uh, yeah, it was, it was really irritating me that I couldn't do what I wanted to do because my knee was hurting so bad. So I figured, hey, maybe if I weighed a little less, <laughs> it wouldn't hurt so much. <laughs> and it, it doesn't hurt as much. So that, that plan worked. So I consider that a success. Yes, top chat and live chat. You want to always be on live chat. Thank you. Thank you, everybody. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. It's, it's been a long journey. But it's it's worth it, you know. And I had to, to make sure, like, I had to convince me that I was worth it. And I know that sounds silly. I mean, I know it may sound, like, even slightly stupid, but it's it's not, really. I I am I am worth looking after, so I need to look after me. Right. I'm here for a good time and a long time. Let's not put no restrictions on me. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. You can't hold me back. No. I won't let you. Oh, did I? Did I? Oh, I did. I did. I found one that fit. Nice. I know. Celebrate good times. I found a piece. I found a piece. <laughs> I just had a breakthrough on the beak. Nice. Nice. And here is a good portion of the forehead, I think. 
Oh, good so. job. Look at you go. I'm still this working piece. on my log. <laughs> I, I can't find the pieces that I need for here, so I figure oh, okay. might as well move to another part and see if I can find more there. There you go. Yeah, like and that's what I mean. Sometimes you forget you're you're important too, right? You can't you can't get lost lost in the the hubbub of everybody else. You're you're important. Yeah, it can be very hard to remember that. Uh, that you're worth. Yeah. You're worth something. Yeah. Yeah. And that you matter, and that you're important to people. You matter. You matter to you me. You matter. You matter. Got to remember it old. What's your other YouTube channel? Home and hearth living. Does this puzzle it has a straight edge border, or is it the shape of the? It's just the shape of the bird itself. Yes, it, yeah, it's it just, is the shape of the bird. Yeah, it's just the. Oh, thank you, Pat. Big hugs. Big hugs. Thank you. Yeah, exactly. You only got one body. Like, thank you, everybody. Appreciate it. And I, I wanna, you know, I got things to do. I got places to go. I got people to see. And, you know, I got, I got a list. I got a quilt list like so long. You got no so idea. Long. So long. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be here a long time. <laughs> For sure. Eat me into the clip. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, 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 your list is in my sewing room. <laughs> Just gonna go shop at Gwenny's sewing room. <laughs> I need anything else in the future. I got, I got like a good section, a section going on here. Nice. You may actually need these before I do. Uh, maybe we'll we'll wait. We'll wait till we we get there. Because I'm still working on the edges, right? And now it's starting to go down into where it's joining into to where the nails and stuff are. So close, 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 but not not quite there yet. Yet. Not quite there yet. Yet. My dear, I feel like the piece, one of my pieces is like just staring me in the face going, hi, I'm over here. Like this one right here, hi, I'm over here. It's giving a reach. No worries. And I was right. Yay. Um, bring it on. <laughs> My friend's shop is my sewing room. Yep. <laughs> Will you both carry on this on in the evenings working together? We'll do, we'll we'll probably just drag you guys along with us if you want to come along. So we'll, we'll do it out here. The, this is the the best space to do it with the light and uh, you know and 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 movement. Well, it depends on the. I I guess the viewership. If the viewership ain't ain't very much for. For this after the stream we may just do it on our own time oh well that's up to you honey i'm, I'm up for whatever but we would like to f finish it you know preferably before his birthday so if anything we'd probably we maybe work on it and next uh maybe next sunday for a couple hours we just stream well we'll see we'll see how the the week goes or maybe even friday night for a little bit if you're not busy or if you got other things i totally understand mm. I should be free at least one Friday night. What you looking for? 
I mean, mac and cheese. That oh, one. we haven't had mac and cheese in a long time. This one right here? Thank you. Uh, we've got um, we've got a big piece of cardboard we can slip it onto or slip the pieces onto and then it can go to the back of the long arm and hide there. Uh, my birthday is 10 days from now. The 22nd. Oh, I think I finally found it. Oh my goodness. I did. I did finally find the one that went to claw. <laughs> okay, very nice. Very nice. Now, now, now what? <laughs> I got that far. Now, now where do we go? Scrum diddly umptious. <laughs> We're getting our stuff together. We're getting our stuff together. Whatever the weather. We're getting our stuff together. That's what he said. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even think we're getting our stuff together right now. I'm just confused. <laughs> I'm like, wait a second here. I mean, I'm getting my stuff together. <laughs> and then kudos to you, those. Can you, oh, can you move the mat so you can sew? No, no, we won't move the mat. The mat is actually taped to the desk. It's actually, um, what do they call it? Uh, yeah, we're just going to slide it onto. Yeah, we have a big piece of cardboard. Uh, a piece of cardboard when we resume the uh, n normally scheduled quilting. <laughs> normally scheduled quilting program. <laughs> yes. <laughs> well, hopefully we're not boring everybody. We don't want to bore anybody. Just wanted to do something a little bit different than something together. And not just be not just be focused on the sewing. Though I know most people that's why they're here. You know, I get it if you're, if you're not having a good time. Well, let's not let's not assume that they're having a bad time. Maybe they're having a good time. Okay. As as people have said, they are enjoying the, uh, the just sitting and chatting. Jeez, I love it when it goes together. The wolf is leaking. Yeah, I was like, was that a critter? I wasn't too sure what was going on up there. I was like, uh, hello? But it stopped. <laughs> we could have a visitor. <laughs> we could have a visitor. It's very much inquisitor. Hmm. Oh, she'd be raining. I think the umbrella's buried in the back of the car somewhere. Raccoons on the roof. Yeah, I don't know. Well, we do have a chippy. We have a chippy. Chippy likes the living in here. Oh, Eileen Myers, I completely agree. But Mom said that we could do it right here, so. What was what? That we should have done the... Uh... Started on the cardboard? Yeah. Yeah, well. <laughs> uh, We're not worried about can it. Can <laughs> you show the box picture? Uh, can you switch to the I sure overhead? Can. I'm sorry. Yep. There we go. So here, uh, there we is the picture for the uh, puzzle that we're trying to put together. And your youngest actually has the same birthday as me. So happy early birthday to both your sons. Awesome. A lot of March babies. Uh, yeah. Well, well, hey. July was a very popular month. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm looking for a piece that kind of looks like a pine cone, I guess. Pine cone? Oh, hold on. It's a, a leaf. leaf, but it does kind of... In the wrong colors. 
Uh, that's an acorn. Wait, hey, dude, I'm, I'm working on it. I'm looking for spiky. <laughs> <laughs> I'm working on it, dude. I don't, I don't know. Looking for spiky featuring, like, red. Spiky featuring red. Hmm. But it might be a this. mix of two pieces together. Is that real? I don't know. No. No? Okay. I don't think so, at least. Sophie not bothered camping because I guess not. No, she's just all chilling. Pam Reynolds, L L, you are all a joy to watch no matter what. Oh, thank you. Oh, appreciate that. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you, Cindy. You want to trade spots? No. Because <laughs> if it's coming through the roof, it's coming for you. <laughs> I see how it is. <laughs> I'm out of here. I am the sacrificial lamb, I guess. <laughs> One self. One self. <laughs> when it comes to small critters like mousers and stuffers, no thanks. <laughs> Y'all remember that. <laughs> All for the fun with the Fulford family. Aw, oh, thank you, Pat. Appreciate it. <laughs> 15 years old. I'm enjoying just chilling. There you go. Perfect. Scraps from 15 years. Oh, my goodness. Wow, well, you that's... see, Mike, there's like 30 different types of swirls. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> 30,000 types of swirls. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think we uh, overestimated our puzzle skills <laughs> drastically. At least I overestimated what I thought could be my puzzle skills. <laughs> Drastically. <laughs> hmm. Maybe it's multiple pieces put together. For Maybe. So I'm trying to find the pieces that bridge from there to there, which is that little bit. If it's a mouse, I'm at it. Yes, ain't Sylvia. I am out. Uh, Pop has literally seen me jump vertical. <laughs> she <laughs> and don't then, jump. <laughs> and then horizontal, all in the same movement, not even touching anything in between to avoid a mouse. <laughs> That's a mid <laughs> yeah, it, yeah. So I'm not thinking anything except there's something in the roof between me and the roof, <laughs> the ceiling and the roof. <laughs> yeah, I was, I was up and that the... away. Like I'm gone. <laughs> I you know. I did that. I did that. <laughs> huh. I've seen chickens go after mice. It's their logo. Aw, that's cute. And that's the piece that I was trying to find. And then the tiniest little piece, that I, wherever that went, because I showed it in my hand how tiny that piece was, goes in the center. Yeah, now where did it go? Uh, yeah, it's in here somewhere. <laughs> oh. Yeah, oh. <laughs> <laughs> now you asked for it. <laughs> Uh, we had a squirrel mouse like the other day. Just I had no idea how it got in there. <laughs> I, I'm going to tell you a story um, about, oh, is it 22? So I'm going to say 2016. Uh, I was headed to, I think I was going to Maple Lodge. I was headed from Hillsburg and I was going to Mississauga for to Maple Lodge Chicken Farm. And I was getting chicken and cooked chicken and stuff. And I had been, it was Saturday or Sunday. I don't remember. I think we were streaming on the Sundays at that point in time. So it must have been the Saturday. And I had left the windows open in the Jeep. Okay, because it was a beautiful day the day before, whatever, and I'd totally forgotten about the windows open in the Jeep, right? Well, it was a little chilly when I got in, so I, I got, get in the Jeep, drive in, rolling up the windows. I think I left the back ones open a little bit. I hear this rustling. So I'm trying to figure out, oh my gosh, what's in the Jeep with me? 
It was a squirrel. <laughs> it didn't like that we were moving. <laughs> it totally was protesting on this new um, thing adventure. It was unwillingly to go on with me. I also was uh, very much protesting of it coming along on the adventure with me. I'm trying to drive, trying to figure out where the squirrel's going. I'm like, this is not good. All the windows down. I'm like almost flipping out the doors on the Jeep, trying to get the squirrel out. <laughs> I was like, what the heck? next time? You know, do a little shake or tap <laughs> to wake anything up. <laughs> it was like, I about, I about had a heart attack. I did end up pulling over far enough and it ended up going out the window. But uh, of its own volition, um, of its own volition, went out one of the back windows. Yeah, yeah. So I don't know where it went. I don't. E I even looked in the mirror. I don't even know how it hit the ground, or if it even hit the ground, or just flew into a tree. I don't know, because it was not happy, and neither was I. We were both on mutual agreement there. <laughs> <laughs> we were both not pleased with the situation. What was happening? Good job. Very nice. Yeah, that was what the heck. <laughs> Yeah, totally wasn't great. I don't know. He was looking for something, looking for lunch. Never was much of doing puzzle, but watching the two of you has got me willing to try again. Just bought a puzzle on. There you go. I like that. Thank you, Pete Gilberty. Gibbeter? Gibbety? I think the main thing for puzzles is you have to have somebody doing it with you. Yeah, that's the fun part. It's not really too... Well, I guess you could do it by yourself, but... The, the fun part is Having doing it together. Having company makes a major difference. So if you want, we're for hire. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. <laughs> no. No. Kidding. Can't say we're uh, puzzle experts, but we'll definitely keep you company. <laughs> Our motives are definitely puzzling. <laughs> that too. That too. Uh, I feel like I've become stagnant and I don't know where to go. Then start working on another piece. I know. That's what I was going to do. Let's just look for something else here. Okay. Stand up and look at that. Trying to smite that bee. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That was. I was like, what is rustling? First, I thought it was a mouse, of course. And then I saw in the mirror, as in my peripheral vision, it was a squirrel. And like I said, he was not happy or she was not happy and neither was I. <laughs> It was time to move on. <laughs> it was a no-win situation. No, there was no winning on that situation. And then I forgot about it for a couple of days, and then something reminded me. I'm like, oh, hey, guess what happened the other day? Was I went to go to the, to the, uh, to the, the store, or to the chicken place. Because by that time, by the time I got back, it had been like three hours had passed, you know, shiny object and everything, you know, tension span of a net. So it was like, whoa, moving on. Look at that. Look, shiny objects in the yard. Okay, pick a few more pieces. See if I can find what I'm looking for. Door. Sophie hears something. What do you hear, Sophie? Uh, Grace, that's actually the uh, the kind of thing that we're doing right now. Uh, this is the owl, and a bunch of the pieces are shaped like animals. Yeah. Uh, here, here, oh, here. And then I've got a bird one here. There's a chinchilla somewhere. Yeah. Chinchilla. Yeah. yeah, they're all really cute. Part of the fun is figuring out the different animals. Yes. I agree. I'm actually finding this coming together quite quickly. 
I'm thinking we probably should have allotted a little bit more time for it. So maybe if Pop's okay with it, we can maybe go for a little bit longer. Uh, you're having fun. I am, and I would really <laughs> like to, to make a bit more of a bigger dent in this. So. Well, I'm glad you're having fun, Mom. I, I am too. I'm glad you're having fun. No, that's not your pine cone. It's a leaf, no, though. I already found my pine oh, cone. Oh, that's right. That's right. That's right. Correct. Pop's fighting with the mail server issue. Uh oh. That's not good. Yeah, here's like a little squirrel and a star and a cat. Oops, sorry. And a pig. Hmm. And. This isn't an animal, but a mushroom. Yeah, then there's just weird little shapes too, and sticks and branches, and you know, just just odd oddballs, oddballies. This has done a wondrous job at raising my puzzle self confidence. <laughs> <laughs> now that I've done all the easy parts. <laughs> Yeah, I'd say you're right. That's a leak. Yeah. Well, all the more reason the roof needs to get redone. She got holes. She got holes in them there roofings. Blue pointy nubbins. Blue pointy nubbins. Ooh. It's like this one, but not this one. Okay, okay. It's right there. Yeah, it's right there. Why can't you see it? It's right there. Come on. It's right there. Yeah. Pine cone? And I'm looking for another blue pointy nubbin that isn't the one that I just wanted. <laughs> there's one more. Well, I can only help so much. <laughs> <laughs> Don't expect miracles, buddy. Come on now. It's going to make sense to make these tiny revolver with tiny pieces. It's perspective, right? <laughs> Well, if you think about it, quilting is kind of like putting a puzzle together. It's exactly. Well, you're cutting up perfectly good fabric, which some people would think is completely bizarre to begin with, but nonetheless, it's just something you just got to get used to. <laughs> Move and adapt. Yeah. Sew the puzzle pieces together to make a quilt. Yeah. Over here, what are you working on? Uh, a, a couple of different pieces. I've got some pieces that might go. I've got okay. three. Got three to go together. And this. Whoa, whoa, whoa. whoa. Okay, now you're overwhelming. <laughs> Jeez, dude. And possibly also this. Okay, whoa, whoa, whoa. Back to boat up, buddy. <laughs> Back to boat up. Thank you very much, Sylvia. She was the one that suggested that I had some of the pieces for what you were working on. Oh, thank you, Sylvia. Yeah. Am I in 
membership for the guild to go through like someone told me to use something other than my phone oh yes it doesn't quite like phones it doesn't 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 <laughs> yeah exactly there's our permission i had a raccoon, a raccoon, a raccoon get into my pickup one day because i left my window down while i was at work came out to them up after I was done for the day. Don't remember who came out of the truck faster. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. These, I think it could, it could have. Yep, sorry. These are close, but they are along there and along there. Or right in the center of the chest area. For the ones that I have up here. Oh, did I? Oh, look at me go. I guess that means that these would be useful to you. Yeah, I'll just... Out. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you going? 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 Yeah, I'll pass this pile over to you because you're working in a closer area. See that? It's passing the pile on. But making progress, though. Yeah. Making progress. I'm just trying to make sure you had the pieces to continue making progress. Oh, I thank you. <laughs> thank you. Thank you very much. You ain't trapped in the cycle that I am. Hmm. Is it vicious? Very. Very vicious cycle. Absolutely brutal. Hmm. Yeah, the snail's cute. There's a couple of snails. Nap time back in. Okay, take care, Mike. We're here for a little bit longer. We're here for like three hours and 15 more minutes. So now remember, in about approximately 15 minutes, we got to do the switch over to the second part of the stream. So it should be if you're under your subscriptions and you refresh, you'll see part two. Make sure you're going to part two when it comes to 3 p.m. Eastern, okay? Start the blue now, pass them on, says Sylvia. <laughs> Watching you, Sylvia. Watching you. <laughs> Anyone who's made a t-shirt quilt, what do you recommend for interfacing? Stabilizer. Medium stabilizer, Kelly A. Hands down. Stabilize the shirt first, then trim up. Don't trim and then stabilize. Stabilize, then trim. Okay? Definitely. Oh, she be raining. At least the wind it doesn't look, seem like it's howling yet, even though it was supposed to start a little while ago. Actually, no, I think it's supposed to start coming up. Sorry, my bad. Okay. I'd like to know what goes in there. Where art thou forth, nubbin? <laughs> What, what nubbin color do you need? I need a blue a nubbin. A blue? A blue nubbin? Yeah. By the power of Grayskull, I will find the blue nubbins. No. no, but that's an outside and an outside piece, so we can put those up here. If I was a blue nubbin, where would I be? No? Okay. Yeah. Oh, you've got some outside pieces over there that are the same shape as the ones that I'm working over here. Okay, so whoa, whoa, what are these guys? The light blue. Okay. There, there's those. And this and this. And these guys too? I can't quite see the... Yes. Yeah? Okay. Worst case scenario, I slide them back. No, no. No, no. They're yours now. Ah. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's that's part of Officially the game. Officially my problem. <laughs> <laughs> Does the tail and wing tips uh, attach to your log yet? Not yet. Uh, there's, there's something that's almost going on, and I think I may have this upside down. I'm not quite sure. Oh, I see what you mean. Okay, I think you might be right. This one right here might. Oh, it does. It does. 
It does, it does, it does. Oh, come on, come on, you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Talk to me, baby, talk to me. I got me a little claw <laughs> Okay, uh, let's see here. No, no, no. We do, we do, we do, we do, we do have a little bit there, though. We do have a little bit there, though. Do have a little bit there, though. Very nice. Aha, uh -huh, thank you. I didn't think we were that far ahead. And look at us. Look at us. See, I like it when we all work together. <laughs> yeah, that's a good progress. Yeah, big progress there. Felt like that was a huge jump. Chat builds a puzzle, you betcha. <laughs> okay, back was on the phone with the long armor. Oh, very nice. What did you have to say, Carissa? Hopefully all good news. Thank you, Pamela. Appreciate that. Thank you, Sylvia. You guys are awesome. I wonder if we could zoom oh. that back in. Uh, hold on. The overhead. And then we can put whatever you're working on there and chat can help you. And I can struggle in the background. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> we all work together. We all live together. Together. Okay, that was a boring fit. And it just worked. Nice. <laughs> Love the closer. Okay, you're hoping that helps a little bit. So I think what I have going on right here is... this little part like it's come down to here and then we have this part here and we have this part here that we just need to get the little pieces that get them all together so yeah. and then i need my little Can my I stick buddy that and i'm working on these bottom of the frame there is a yellow piece by itself at the bottom of the frame yellow piece by itself what am I thinking? What am I looking at? Well, keep in mind that yeah. if they're meaning the bottom of the screen, it's up there for us. Okay. There's a couple of, ooh, it's really raining out there. Good gravy. Oh, what else? Okay. Near Sophie Cam. Near Sophie Cam. Uh, that would be. Oh, okay. No, no, that's the here. This one. Yeah, that might be useful. Yeah, it's it's a little feather. It's like a little tiny feather. Yeah. Super cute. But it matches the pattern. It does very much so. Very much so. Appreciate that. <coughs> Cheers. Okay, now let's see what we got and what can we fit. I kind of want to finish my little sticky branch thing going on here. Mm -hmm. Don't look into that now, baby. I think that goes in there. Come on, you. Because you gotta have the melting somewhere. It's not this, is it? No. So you said it was blue, right? Okay, no. that's why I didn't hand those to you to begin with, because I was like, I don't think that was the right one. 
Okay. And we got that. I got my stick. Now I just need my my leaf. I think those might be my leaf tips. Okay. Uh, next right. to the left of Sophie's frame. Uh, these, there is 650 pieces. Yeah. That piece would be one of the... Sides, yeah. Put it down the edges. Okay. <laughs> Slowly things are moving. <laughs> yeah. Hey, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Now you like you creeping on my territory. <laughs> Back the boat up, Bubby. <laughs> this one looks like a little dragon or a seahorse or something. It's cute. I did find it was a little easier on some spots to, to stand and look to looky loo to find. I'm still short enough that the uh, the light glare causes all the pieces like right over here to just be to be white. Let's see if this will go there. It sucks that I'm looking for a blue piece because all of these sure have blue. <laughs> <laughs> a little bit of something, that's for sure. Does that larger piece on your right, uh, right of right side of the log fit into it? Right here? No, not yet. We need some the tail and the other wing bit uh, first before it all yeah. all gets together. Let me mm. give them another look at the. She has the uh, the left side. I think it's left side. Uh, of the of the log, and she needs the center and the. Yeah, there's a little, a couple little buddies to go in between. We're still trying to figure those out. Yeah, kind of not really visible on screen is the kind of center of the head. Yeah, got the center. I've been working on right here. And then we got the two little tails that we're trying to get connected down here. We got the one done though. Thank you. The, Thank you to everybody. The tails are off screen. Here we go. Your shoulder. Oh, there we go. Perfect. All right, found a piece. Um, hmm. And I've got a bunch of pieces over here that I'm ninety percent sure are part of the eyebrow bit. Yeah, I'm I'm working on the eyes here. And I'm working oh, there we on go. the kind of eyebrow crown thing. This is a lot of fun though. Oh, thanks. Thanks for doing it with me. I've been fun with the puzzles. Finding the next piece in my chain. Mm. <coughs> Which means I have to go fishing for me more pieces. Oh, there's not the tape. 
Так, 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 так. This is the weirdest looking rabbit I have ever seen. <laughs> it's got the ears. It does have the ears of and a it rabbit. It very much does not look like a rabbit. <laughs> it's a little bit of cray cray. <laughs> uh, yes, base. That is part of the plan. Uh, I am going to. We're going to mount it on uh, cardboard or on poster board. Uh, cut it to be the shape of the puzzle. And then I'm going to be able to just hang the owl itself on my wall. I'm very much looking forward to that. That's going to be cool. Very, very much so. Ooh, I think we have a connection. No? No, oh, close, close, but no cigar. Close, but no cigar. We're almost, almost. I had a train of thought, but it's lost. <laughs> they happen, and then they go. <laughs> and then they happen, and then they go. <laughs> That's what happens with the train. It chewed, chewed, chews down the track, and then poof, gone. I'm sorry, you said what, what? Already half the time of the, the stream is done, apparently. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, all right, so are we going to number two now? So if you, make sure you go to the Mama Pop Quilt Shop YouTube page and uh, go and click stream number two because we're going to have to shut this one down. I don't know how we're doing that. I don't, can you do that, Pop? Can you do that from where you are? Uh, I'm apparently quiet. Probably because my mic died. Oh, alrighty. Well, we can plug you in. No worries. Oh, hold on. Give me a second. So you may get my, my fat head in the mold. Just need to find the right 